But Distant Worlds 2 came out last year, about this time last year, and I really liked the game. Uh, there was some some bugs and some some there was just some inconsistencies. We'll call it that when it first came out, and uh, I haven't touched it since then. But there's been a few updates. There's been a, a big update, a big free update just came out called Aurora. Uh, and in addition to that, we've also got a new DLC, which added two new factions into the game, which I have, and we'll check that out today. Uh, but from what I understand, what I have heard, the game is is much better than it was at launch. So we're going to try it out and see how it is. Uh, if you're not familiar with the game, this is a Space 4X game. Think of this something something like Stellaris, but uh, where Stellaris is very uh, min maxi, right? Uh, and you go in and you you command everything around. You are in charge of everything. You can do that on this one, but it's not really built to be that way. Um, you can automate. You could literally automate everything, and you can just sit back and let the game play itself. Uh, you've got the military part of the game, and you've got the civilian part of the game, and you kind of got to work those together. But and you can turn on and off whatever you want to automate and play that part of the game. Um, so if you want to just if you want to just handle the conquests and let the game handle the the uh, resource moving around and the mining all that you can do that. If you want to handle the mining and let the game handle the conquests, you can do that. And um, it's a pretty beefy game. There's a lot going on here, and it which explains the the problems at the, at, the, at the launch. But apparently things are better. So let's try it out. First off, we're gonna build ourselves a galaxy, and I think we're gonna go with uh, like a nice 500 star. Classic? Do we want classic? Let's go with a classic galaxy. It gives you a little warning here about um, going too big, your computer's going to chug, which is kind of nice. But we're going to start out in pre-warp. I think pre-warp is probably the best way of, of seeing the game. You start out, you know, we're just we're just a, we're just a race of spiders. We're going to be spider people today. Uh, hanging out on planets, we've discovered a, a, um, an old artifact that had some tech in it. So we, we, we're dreaming of the stars now, and that's where we're going to begin. Just dreams, but we'll get our way there into the stars, into the moon, and into the planets, and then out of the solar system, and then conquering and pillaging soon enough. Uh, there is random research paths, which we'll have that turned on. Um, so we will have, you know, variety in the game, and tech trading is on. It's fine. Um, let's go with everything else kind of a normal. Normal pirates, normal monsters, space creatures will be normal. Um, I think on my last, um, when I, when I, Play it. At release, I played. I think I turned that up to many, and there was a space monster like that like, chewed through. It was kind of neat, but it was like a, the space monster was like chewing through the uh, some of the empires. It was great. <laughs> um, we'll leave everything at, at normal. Normal's fine. And our new races that we have for this DLC is the Dayut, which is the spider people, which is who we're going to be, and the, and the Akuru, who are the large muscular primates with fur um so monkeys with ears and they have i don't actually remember i didn't actually look and see what they are all about respect for life secrets of life protection of life they start with beam weapons they seem to be kind of like i think they're kind of like a friendly they typically live in tree dwelling high in the forest i think they're like, they're like uh are they wookies i think, think they're kind of wookie like hang out in trees um, they repair machinery, they confidently reverse engineer new devices, so they're like, yeah, I think that's kind of what they are. Um, last time we played the game, I played as these guys, which are like furry Jawas. Wookie and Monkey is the accru, okay. Elvish Wookies. They're pacifists, like the terraform planets, okay. Uh, I played these guys, these are the, um, Basically, like Jawas, just furry Jawas, or or um, gnomes, I suppose, would be a better like a, a fantasy comparison. But anyway, today we're going to be the uh, the Dayut. and now you may think you know there's not a whole lot of races here. These are the ones that that you can play, the playable races. There are other ones in the game. Um, they are just not uh, developed like these are, and these have like, their own ships, you know, and all that whole whole theming thing with them. Um, there is no custom race thing yet. That was one of the perks, one of the one of the nice things of Distant Worlds Universe. The first one is you could like play as pirates, uh, and that's not here yet. But we also random up. Oh, we'll stick with the, the new stuff and see what it is. So we are a large, powerful arachnid race. Diutes have massive, distended head with a with prominent red splotches, splotches, <laughs> splotches, and large orange yellow eyes. We're aggressive and highly unfriendly. We like deserts. 
Uh, we we start with some some hyperdrive research and some attack ground ground attack strength. Um, we're we're all in the you know um, some business. Uh, <laughs> um, people don't like us, and we don't like them, so it's okay. Uh, we're gonna be. Oh, I didn't even think of a good empire name. Hey, Raider, how's it going? Somebody give me a good a good spider um, name. Um, oh, what's the spider in Lord of the Rings? Um, my mind went blank. I can't remember her name. But uh, anyway, anyway, we'll pick our flag and then we'll go find our uh, our name. This looks like a couple bananas. Let's be uh, let's be that one there. Sheila, yeah, yeah. So we could go with. I mean, that that thought would be a good empire, would it? Uh, anyway, our you can see kind of our pluses and minuses here. Tourism, no one wants to come to our planet. I don't know why. Uh, just a bunch of giant spiders. I can't imagine why. Uh, the war weariness is it's good, all good stuff. We like es espionage. Um, our leadership typically lasts 60 years. Um, typically, the way we get new leaders is a coup d'etat. <laughs> so that's how you get a new leader. This is with our government of surveillance oligarchy. We can change this to a dictatorship or a hive mind or a feudalism. But of course, we're going to take the surveillance oligarchy. You know, we're watching you with at least seven of our eyes. Spiders make the best protein shakes. <laughs> yeah, so we can we can choose any of those. We could be a hive if we wanted to. Um, but no, we'll go with we'll go with the surveillance. That seems that seems seems all right. Eight legged freaks. Um, I'm gonna go with um, the ah um, uh, octo. Octonoctopia. Huh? It's alright. Just just go with it. Top of my head. Uh, our home system, we'll stick with everything as, as normal as it is. We'll start with pre-warp tech. So any location, I'm fine. They can be anywhere. That's fine. Alright. Uh, we're going to start with 20 empires. That's the most we can start with on auto-generating. You can actually add more in. You can So you can randomly throw in 20, and we can actually add more in if we wanted to. Um, oh, I, I'm pretty sure there's a way of adding in more, but we can actually, we can put 19 random in an ad, whatever we want, of whatever race, you know, or, or put whoever it is. So we can say this, we're going to put, let's put in the, um, um, the Wookiees. And they're going to be the, the new folks. And then we can put how good they are. You can even, like, make, like, a, like a really tough people if you want, I suppose. Arachnoctopia. Arachnoctopia. That's way better. Um, we're gonna be the um, the Arachnooks. Okay, I don't like it, but I'm gonna go with it. Okay, we'll leave it at that. And before we hit this, we're gonna tell a dad joke. Uh, this isn't a dad joke. This is a true story. I'm sitting in the house, and uh, I noticed uh, I heard some some clucking sounds coming from a chicken coop. Out in my backyard. Um, problem is, we don't have any chickens. And I know what it was. It was the poultry geist. If the editor is available, you can do... Oh, okay, the editor is how you do it. Okay. Okay. Uh, anyway, we'll leave, we'll leave the starting stuff as it is. Uh, we're probably not going to get to the end of a game. I mean, maybe we could if we like if we lowered this, we could probably have a game that ended like in an hour or whatever. But we'll just leave it as is. We're gonna we're gonna play we're just gonna play sandboxy, and we can turn these off and just play sandboxy if we wanted to, just to see what we can get to. I like I like that one. That's a good that's a good thumbnail picture. Put the title "Distant Worlds" right there. It's good stuff. That one hurt a little. Oh, good good. Don't worry, the next one will hurt even more. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, so um, for those of you who haven't seen the game, we'll I'll, I'll show what's going on here. But again, it's very automated, and so if we wanted to, we could just sort of sit back and let the game play itself. But we'll we'll, we'll we're more of a king sitting back. That's how I'm going to play it. More of a king sitting back and story driven. Um, you know, requests will come in, and we'll we'll answer them and send our ships wherever we. Um, you know, we'll guide them. They'll ask us, hey, you want to build this ship? Sure, go ahead. You want to colonize here? Maybe. You know, that kind of stuff. So our faction, we are the Arachnooks. It's bad. Uh, we are the surveillance oligarchy. We are the Diut. Typically aggressive and unreliable. Natural skills and hyperdrive research, war weariness reduction, and a gra attack ground, ground attack strength. Uh, 
So Conid here is our leader, and he's skilled in calling his happiness, calling happiness, war weariness, and tourism income. Excellent. See, he's a friendly spider. He's cuddly. Uh, our home is Breeby, desert savanna planet in the Kerbis system. Nearby is a gas giant. Also nearby is a volcanic moon, Haita. We're a primitives technology. Let's take our first steps. Oh, this is the best part of it. Yeah, with zooms on in. Uh, look at that. Oh, we're on a moon, aren't we? We're starting on a moon. That's great. So this little story is basically giving me the rundown of, of what's happened here, which I already told you. We, we're a bunch of spider people. Uh, we're living on our deserty planet, and we found some ruins, which gives us um, hints of our distant past that maybe we aren't actually from this planet. And maybe we can learn that tech and get out of here. So we find the technology that allows us to get early warp field rest experiments and stable warp fields, which allows us to leave, you know, um, faster than light and all that. Yeah, check that out. I haven't been on a moon yet. Cool. Cool. Okay, so uh, the game's going to play out here for a minute. And I'll run. I'll give you I'll give you the rundown. So my, my capital is here. Uh, Diute here, we're on Breeby, the moon of, whatever that, Kerbis 7 here, very purple. We've got another moon nearby, which is this uh, volcanic moon over this way. And on this planet, there are, I think it said 200 million? It said, no, there's 2 billion, 2 billion spiders on this planet. Ugh, shivers, shivers just thinking about it. Uh, we are at the moment building a construction ship a small freighter, and a mining ship. We're also working on this... Where is it at here? A shipyard right over here. And you can see them sending the ships out to go and build this shipyard. And this will allow us to build, you know, other things, obviously. Um, and at the moment, everything's kind of running on its own. I'm not really doing anything. But the game's just sort of playing itself. And, and, and that will continue to happen. If we want to adjust any of that stuff, we can do that in here, policy settings. We can change anything. Um, like we can say, even custom, even colonization is automated. I'm having a right there. They will suggest it to me. Hey, you want to colonize this planet? Sure. They will send out a, um, uh, uh, its own colony ship. They'll build it and send it out. I can do it. I can change everything to manual. If I want to min max everything, I can. And that's where all this is in here. I'm going to leave it as it is. I've tweaked it a little bit. So I, where I like it, mostly custom, mostly default stuff though. Um, we have our state economy. We're making a hundred bucks uh, a year. And that's by we're spending money on ship and maintenance and stuff. But we're actually making more than that because we have a private economy. That's making 15000 And so whenever we go out, we mine these planets, we get these resources in. And then we have the private economy deals with all the haul and the resources and things, which are all listed in here. There's lots of resources. And we need these. We need these resources to build ships and fuel the ships and, and for, for luxury stuff, that kind of thing. Um, if you find if having colonization on recommended is really annoying because if you decline building colony ship, it'll just keep asking. I've noticed that I noticed that last time. I haven't played in a year, so I'm not sure if it's still like that. But yeah, it would do it before it would like it say we want to build a we want to build a um, a mining station on this planet, and you say no, don't put it there, and then it would say a year later we really want to build a mining station on this planet. No, leave me alone. We really want to build it, so we just constantly keep on pestering you about it. But yeah, I don't know if it's still like that or not. Anyway, this is our tech tree. Uh, this is all we know. We can only see the first line of stuff. It goes out a ways here. Um, we're also on randomized tech, so it'll whatever we'll we'll learn enhanced sensors, and it'll go to something else. We don't know what's next in line. Um, what we want to work on right now, though, is uh, no, no, doing that. Uh, I clicked on something. Uh, we want we want to work on uh, warp field experiments. So we're going to put all of our eggs in the basket of early warp field experiments, and we're put a thousand we're putting thousand bucks into it. Make sure they get that done because that's going to get us off of our planet here and away. We can go to the moons. It just takes a, like years to get there right now. Eventually we'll get there. And yeah, there is of the new stuff in the game. My, my head's kind of in the way of these little buttons here, but you're not missing anything. Um, we do have a free form. Uh, view, which we can now see a little bit better uh, at things. So we're not, we're not so, it's basically it's not so constricted of what we can look at. It looks like a crab. Makes sense, I suppose. It's a crab station. Um, but we're not, uh, it, it's, it makes the battles look a lot cooler. Basically, if you put it in free form mode. What's the default B? 
So uh, over here on the planet in, in Breeby, they are – they're already automatically building things. They will build freighters. That's the private stuff, building things. We're building construction ships. I'm going to go in here immediately and tell them to whip up a couple of exploration ships and go ahead and get them cranked out and so we can get some exploring done because as soon as this tech is done, then we've got some uh, – we got some exploring to do. Um, what else we got to look at here? So we change funding levels if we want. I think I have this set on automa automatic. Yeah, it is. So we may, mess, we may mess with that later, but we are mostly putting more money into colony growth, which is probably okay. Small military fleet. Yeah, we can do that. Um, I don't know. So pirates used to be real bad. And I've heard that pirates have been toned down quite a bit because it used to be like, the early game was just you fighting pirates, basically. And I've heard that that has been tamed down a lot. So we'll see how it is. Um, I just was playing a game earlier today, and I didn't have any pirates. In my my home system didn't have any pirates. And I thought that was kind of like a given before, is you'd always have pirates in your main system. Sorry, I'm just getting some beauty shots of the planets here. Uh, we got some ruins, looks like, over this way. But we can't go there. It, takes, it would take 50 years to go fly over there, so maybe not quite that long. But we're working on... Uh, getting some things researched here, which this guy, you can see this this traveler over here, strange ploy, is trying to fly there. It's going to take him a long time. You can see the time ticking by. This is, a this is a day, and so he's going very slowly over there to go explore it. But once we get this tech, he'll go a whole lot faster. And all we're really worried about right now is getting this, getting this guy built up, my shipyard built up, uh, and getting that tech done. That is what we're looking for. Let me say pay them off if they are your races. And you, yeah, I did that last time I played. I I was able to get the ones that were my race, the pirates that were the same as me. I had them out. I had them basically. They were they were as much as an ally as you can be with pirates. The other ones I didn't make friends with, but those those were were, were good. We can like send them. I think we could send them to like mess with other folks or something. Uh, down here is all the all the planets in my system. I am a desert people, and so. We only really have we have Kerbis one and Kerbis two might be be livable. Um, everything else is may not actually work for us, but we can still put in like mining stations and stuff. So here's a here's a request. Uh, they want to build a small spaceport at Breeby. Yes, please. And we have built the construction ship done. Okay, so there's our spaceport getting ready to be done, and there's our shipyard that is now done. Looks like a big crab. Yeah, I like it. Uh, and then we, and then we got a new spaceport coming in, which we which we certainly want. I think I just hit tab. Does it, how does that work? Oh, yeah. Okay. You just hit tab and it does it. Oh, yeah. And then B goes back. There we go. He's still flying over there. It's going to be a while. Breen Confederate. Yeah, yeah. That's kind of, yeah. That's kind of have a Breen look to it. You're right. Pay them one time instead of having the forever war with them. Yeah, well, you can do, like, they, you know, you pay them, like, a yearly thing is how it works. You know, we make sure there's no trouble. We'll give us some money. We'll make sure there's no trouble, that kind of thing. Um, far as our people, so we got Conan here is ruling us. He will be there until someone stabs him in the back. Uh, and we've got Mad Dog. <laughs> Bad, Mad Dog. No one calls me Mad Dog. Uh, is our general here. He's not going to do anything. He's just hanging out. Um, you know, just being a mad dog, I guess. Uh, we don't have any spies yet. So no prisoners yet. We'll get all that later on. Hyperspace technology has been discovered. It's a momentous discovery as warp drive basically has been discovered. Now we're going to go work on... Um, where is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, stable warp fields. We're going to go ahead and pay the money to get this thing uh, started up. That'll get us outside of our system. Right now, we are just stuck in our system. And you'll start seeing these guys will start going a lot faster. They want to build an exploration ship. I agree. And we got a new, new scientist. Old Cossett is here. So he's going to slowly make his way there. Oh, is he Is he there? Oh, he is there. Okay, so he made it. So he should start sending out some, some drones here. And you can kind of see him. Yeah, he's sending out drones to go explore the planet. I'm on 4x speed here, so he's actually going real fast. So, there they go. Our ships are kind of cool. They've got this sort of pokey antenna thing. And there is eight of them. Appropriate. At least eight in the front. 
So at this planet, we have just discovered all kinds of stuff. We discovered some uh, Kazlon, which is fuel. We've got some Krypton, keeps Superman away. We've got Argon. We've got um, something hidden, a research, a, re a reactor research bonus. And because of that, they want to build a research station here. So we can come in here, and I agree that's a good idea. So we're going to tell them to go ahead and assign the mission to go get a research station at this planet. Uh, we can also tell them to go ahead and get a mining station. Which is a good idea, because there's a lot of Kazlon here, which we need for fuel. We're going to need a lot of that stuff. So we'll go ahead and tell them to get to work on that. And then we'll start getting someone sent over there to get that built up. I don't see anyone flying around yet. Yeah, we're going to go get a pop-up for it. Whenever. Yeah, it is, it is a good good bonus. Uh, there's also asteroids around here. That's actually a pretty good start. Because we can mine all these. Every single one of these asteroids is something we can explore. And there'll be different resources in there. And so we'll put in several different... Um, um, stations that will mine all these asteroids around the belt here around the planet and this guy is slowly making his way over this way and as soon as things get fitted out with uh, with better tech what was it graceful empress uh, then we'll start they'll start flying a lot faster we'll check out this volcanic moon over here and they'll eventually make their way out hey Jeff how's it going does it differ from Sins of a Solar Empire? Yeah, um, I'm trying to think how Sins plays, and Sins is more Master of Orion, right? I think, am I thinking correctly? It's more, um, like big picture. You mean, you control everything. Am I right about that? Anyway, we've got a new construction ship, or a new, uh, exploration ship, which should probably be taken off here in a minute. Shall see. Master Ryan 2 style. Yeah, it's a really pretty game. And uh, the, like, each planet is procedurally, gener procedurally generated. So you can see, like, like all these, uh, this here. And as the, as the population grows, the amount of light pollution or whatever will grow. Um, but yeah, no, no two planets are going to look the same. Yeah, there's my home. Many a fine spiders live in there. We got some traders over here, and uh, and as we as we send like like the mining station and and not the resource station not the resource but the mining station will go out there and then they'll start building the private economies will start making freighters and we'll start s selling them and they'll we'll build their build their ships will they will buy their ship parts from us and so we we get a nice chunk of change off of the civilian economy doing well. So having a nice, sturdy economy um, makes you money. <clears throat> okay, our spaceport is done. We should be able to upgrade our spaceport later on. It is now there. This guy's going to start whipping up some... So he's making some freighters and exploration ships and another freighter. Uh, the freighters are the civilian things. And uh, there we go. He's cool looking. Uh, if now I, I'm saying this is more like hands off, but it doesn't have to be. Um, like you can go kind of nutso with this. I'll show you a ship design here. Let's go look at. Uh, this is my one warship I have, which is the, the Batumi, uh, an escort ship. We can edit this guy, and like there's a ridiculous amount of things you can do here. All the stuff that's in the ship is here. So we got fuel cells, modules, the ion drives, and you can change all this stuff out. You want an extra ion drive or whatever. You can throw it in there. This is all stuff that we have that we can put in there. I have this all automated, so whenever something new comes out, it'll automatically um, uh, uh, re redesign this thing. Uh, but if you want to deal with the numbers, then the numbers are there. And you can even see like how much energy it's using and the speed it's using. It's, like, it's ridiculous how much how many numbers are in here. But it's all there. And the resources required, which I'm, yeah, I'm not in front of there. So you can see where the new resources come in. We need steel and polymers and carbonite and, and uh, Mebnar, which we just found, I think. And that's where we need those resources in to build this stuff. In addition to money, of course. Yeah, the planet surfaces are randomized. <laughs> that's right. It's one giant roundabout. <laughs> that's right. That's, uh, yeah, it's a good point. It's very, it's very complicated, but... Um, like right now, I'm not doing anything. Like, um, I've got it pretty much automated. Like all the all the numbers and everything, I've got 
doing its own thing, and I'm just here uh, pushing buttons whenever buttons need to be pushed. So this is this is like Aurora 4X, but it's much more tame, automated, or it can be. I mean, it can it it won't be Aurora 4X, but it can be crazy like that if you want. I have a video of, of Aurora 4X um, from forever ago. Here we go. This guy just just hyper drank, hyper jumped. I think. Where is he? He's the first exploration ship we built. I meant to build this exploration ships after I built the I had the, the warp, but I forgot. But there he goes, the Kerbis Lurker. He's on his way. I don't know where he's going. Probably going out this the Corbus Nine, I guess. Corbus Nine. Oh, he's going here. He's going to Cleum. Someone has made it to the volcano planet and discovered that there is a lot of resources here. Lots of stuff. Aculon and Emerus Crystal. Um, it's not very suitable for us to live there. Minus 41. We went like 20. Uh, but we're not going to happen here. And there's also some more unknown stuff. We need. There's more research or more scanning to be done here. But I will go ahead and tell them to build a mining station here. That's a good spot. Now we want to build an exploration ship. Yeah, go ahead and do that. And there's the resources we just found here on this planet. Moon, I should say. But so now he's over here. And he's going to come in here and start doing the same thing he's been doing everywhere else. He's going to come in and start scanning the place. Start sending probes out, and you can kind of see him in there. As they're going to go start exploring this guy. He's exploration, exploration level one, which basically means we don't know anything. We know the name of it. Um, and it goes up to, I don't remember what it goes up to. 25 or something. But um, as we explore it, we'll learn more resources and things. Uh, let me show you. I've only showed you this one solar system. Let's go on out. And we got a, a, a mad dog. We got another mad dog in, in town. Excellent. We got some resources too. Hang on, let me slow this down. But we'll go zoom out here. There's my sector, basically, of space. And as we explore, we'll, we'll grab some more things. We're kind of, we're not like dead center of the, of the galaxy. We're kind of on the edge here. Good place to be. So, there's our home. There's a whole lot of stars. This is a small galaxy, by the way. Not the smallest, but pretty small. And uh, it's going to be pretty crowded because there's 20 empires in here. Plus all the minor folks and the pirates and all that. Discovered the crash, a crashed Akuro ship. Ancient ruins from a lost civilization from the frozen ice planet Cleum in the Kerbis system. Should we investigate it? There is a crashed Wookiee ship here. Let's investigate that ship. Found a strange alien ship belonging to a species whose shape is disgusting, even to contemplate. On our own homeworld, our philosophers have begun to debate the question of how these creatures did not choose self-genocide. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We've been able to decipher at least part of their language. So it was constructed, uh, it's constructed with powerful security precautions, uh, suggesting these disgusting creatures had the uh, capacity for caution. Attempting to assess certain portions of the ship will set off self-destruct sequence. We must now decide if we wish to retrieve whatever remains in the cargo bay or attempt to access the main databanks and learn more of these aliens and their vile purpose. Do we want what was inside the cargo hold or learn about the people? Let's learn about these things are so disgusting. Let's learn more. The databanks, we've learned that the ancient species called the Shakturi terrified the creatures who piloted this ship. This would be as meaningless to us. Would be meaningless to us since the creatures' appearance suggests they were cowardly by nature, but there are some troubling references to Dayut in the data. It's by no means clear, but the implication is that the security, the Sh Shakturi used the Dayut as expendable soldiers sent into battle for no other purpose but to soften up the Shakturi's foes. Perhaps they're pirates. Captured individual uh, ones of us. Can't be, um... That's outrageous. We found some information along it. We also got the uh, basic medical systems. We got a little bit of tech into there, basically. So, all right. Uh, all that's there, though, is ruins. We is completely explored. So this is kind of a junk planet. Yep. Uh, it's got some like location bonuses and all that, but we can't live there. And there's nothing really to mine there. I don't think we can research lab this. Because that is just going to give us. Oh, okay, well, we actually could do it, couldn't we? We'll see. I'm going to see if they if they will um, send if they will tell me to build. I'm not sure if this is. You can research lab if it has if as long as it has a research lab. So yeah, okay, okay. So as long as it has one, I know these research stations are very good as well. We can we haven't built one yet. But um, was that one done? That one is done. So we can see here, like my my my. Research output right now. I'm getting 12 research from my colony. And I'm getting 37 
from that one, those two stations, the station and spaceport. So stations are very good for research. So we will continue building those. As anytime we have the opportunity to build a research station, we will build it. Okay, so for the first bit of the game, we basically we just sit back and let the exploration happen. And I'm going to encourage a bit more of that by building a couple more exploration ships. And we'll get them sent out there. We have a research station constructed in Kerbis. Excellent. That's the one that was, that was, that's that one. It isn't just now built now. And we have a uh, exploration of Haita. That's the volcanic place. Detected unknown items there. We should explore at levels, higher levels to reveal these things. So there's more stuff here. Um, we're at 15. There's more things here. We know there's some more resources here, which we'll find whenever we go and mine this place. If it's something researchy, we'll get that too. I'm sure, yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure we just looked at like a, we see a human, we probably think, what a disgusting, fleshy beast. I'll step on it. I'm sure. We're halfway there for our stable warp fields. And after we do that, I can, so you can do, what's it, two projects at the same time? Well, we can do one up to one right now. We, later on, I guess we can get more. Um, and we can have more projects at the same time. I do want to get this one first, though, before we do anything else. But we're going to get expanded civilian ships, which will allow us to build um, colony ships. So we can start colonizing some things. So we'll probably get that next, and then we'll worry about whatever else. Yeah, imagine having only two legs. How hideous. I don't even want to think about it. So, Neglik uh, is pinkish tinge. We've, well, we discovered some Tiderius and what was that one? Uh, Hexadorium polymer. Exploration ships have been built. Those are the two I requested. Uh, critical research failure. So, um, this, this is bad stuff. So, whenever you come in here and you can, like, uh, um, you can crash. Um, I thought I did crash. I thought that stuff doesn't happen if you do crash. Because I did crash, right? Yeah. I thought bad tech things didn't happen if you crashed tech. Like, put money into it, basically. But anyway, our tech went way down because we had a big failure at our tech station. You can crash research on the... F oh, just the first warp tech. Okay. It is unlucky. Oh, oh, okay. I, but I, but I can't though, right? Because I'm, um, I can't, I can't, I can't crash it. Crash can fail and put you behind. Okay. Hey, mammals. Seventeen thousand. How much do I have? Oh, I'm broke. That explains it. All right, so that'll go away. Yeah, we're building all those those uh, stations. Now we're, we're bouncing around. We'll keep on uh, bouncing around, and, and uh, once the mining kicks in, we'll start making some cash. We are actually in the in the positive. We're actually much more positive than that because we can see our um, the private economy is doing great. Taxes, fuel, they're buying from me. Um, ship maintenance is all good stuff. I think they buy that stuff from me. Colony taxes paid by the private sector to my uh, of my empire. Yeah, and the fuel costs for those ships. Discovered in Kerbis 2, shiny new metal of, of Kupka. That's this one over here. Is there a, there's a spaceport here? Well, explore it already. It's a derelict spaceport. Interesting. Yeah, resort stations gives you some, some, uh, some tourism. Which our people aren't good at tourism, but because of our guy... I don't remember where to see our... There it is. So our tourism is minus 10, but our guy gives us a bonus of that. There's the abandoned base we just encountered. So tourism is actually zero because he's plus 10. So we're normally minus 10, but minus 10, he's plus 10. So we found a station out here. This one. Uh, let's go investigate. So a small spaceport, heavily damaged, but currently inoperable. We could acquire it by sending a construction ship to repair it. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, I can tell them to do that. Let's go to my fleets here. Actually, I can just grab one um, and send them over there, but they'll they'll get there. We can like manually send these guys around, but they're gonna go. Oh, good, yeah, get that retrofit. It's probably a good idea because 
You're flying very slowly. Most of these guys aren't doing anything. These are just traders out here. And what are you making right now? Nothing? Um, um we found a plus nine percent oh, colony happiness there from idyllic warmer vibe. This is actually good. It's only a minus one for me, but I think we can we can colonize we can um like terraform and make it better. It's a good quality planet. It's just another moon. Got a nice green sunrise. We prefer the the, uh, the purple sunrises, but or planet rises. So suitability is minus one. Um, I think because of the quality, we can we can um, fix it a little better. Uh, Kerbis four is where this continental one over here. It has a lot of uh, resources, like it looks like. Not a lot, but a little bit. I don't have the money to build a mining station over here, so we'll get that in a second. Kerbis 1, we discovered some Dantha fur is a shaggy brown white fur of the Dantha. Large animals that live in the vast deserts of the desert worlds. And this is in Kerbis 1. There's some fuzzy beasts over there. Which we will... Uh, harvest, I suppose. You want to build a shipyard, a construction ship. Yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. More colony development over there. Found some hidden archives over here at these ruins on this ocean planet of Kerbis 3. Ancient ruins from a lost civilization. Let's go investigate. Fascinating discovery. Under the surface of the world, we encountered remains of an ancient structure seemingly built by the Diet. Uh, more evidence of our long-ago greatness. We must find a way to gain access to this facility and learn what knowledge is there. We can use... It's possible to use explosives to blast our way into there. We blast our way into there. Or we can use... Bribe the engineers to hack their way in. A lot of these... I think these these first initial ones are, are kind of like... I think every system has these same ones. Maybe it's just with this race, but I had most of these before. Uh, I had this one before, anyway. Um, they always seek advantage. Hacking would not be an expensive, but it will be a cleaner method than gaining interest. I don't have 15 grand. So we're just gonna blow our way in there. They all is it this, it's not is it is it different with each race? As we figured the explosion damaged a large portion of the facility, but we discovered much value. We found one of the four ships in the hangar was obliterated, but we found some ships. There we go, we got some ships now. We actually have um a defense fleet now. Cool. So we have a fleet of well, we're going to a fleet in a minute. We have the Iron Intimidator, the Iron Renegade, and the Supreme Bastion. I'm going to go refuel over there. They should go into a fleet, I think. As they uh, get head head back over here. There's a patrol escort over here. Each state, each uh, nation has a, or each faction has a, its own unique stories. Gotcha. But the first mining station allows us to gather large quantities of resources. That's good, because we need that. So that'll bring in some more fuel, as well as other things. We discovered um, this one over here, more development. There's also Questurian Skin. Looks like we have Steel and uh, Mebnar here at an asteroid over here. Is this outside? Yeah, this is outside my home planet. So we'll build these these mining stations. This guy, as long as they're within... I don't remember if... We used to have a bigger ring in the olden days. I'm not sure how it works now. So surely they, they have a range of more than just that asteroid. I'm not sure how it works now. Naza, have a good one. Uh, will they not just join in my fleet? You in a fleet. And I should be able to top up with ships. Let me remember how to do this. Wait, roll, I want you to defend. I'm going to defend. And I want... I hope I get you to join his fleet. 
I forget. There you go. Okay, so you guys are all in the first fleet now. And your mission is now just defend. Just defend this system. All three of you. It's been a while. I put a lot of time in this one. It first came out uh, a year ago, but I've played like 400 games since then. <laughs> All right. So, uh, oh, the uh, the star base is done. Yeah, yeah. Assign that mission. Get that done. And build mining station in, in Kerbis Six. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, I agree. So they're asking me if they can build here. Um, the red thing means that we are short on that. So yeah, go, go ahead and do that one. And you also want to build a research station over there, which I think is a great idea. We'll get that get that done. And there's not we're not too much of a hurry to leave our system yet because we've got to get all this other stuff done. So the it's a bit of a setback, but it's not the worst, I suppose. Radius is the weapons range. Okay. So it used... I'm pretty sure it used to be that that was... Like, you would build one of these things, and it would have a range, and that was the amount... That was the asteroids it could reach. I wonder if it reaches more now. Not sure. It seems like they're going to here. Oh, is this just my... Oh, this is my mining station. Never mind. I'm, never, I'm losing it. This is the mining station for my planet. Not for the asteroids. Okay, in Haita we found... What was the other resource we got? Is this one? Usala? Good stuff here. Lots of good stuff here. So we've got... There, there is uh, resources that we need to, like, to build stuff. There's also luxury resources, which... Usually they tell you what they do. Like, Kuprika, shiny metal. Extremely strong, lightweight, shiny red-brown appearance. It is used in beam and torpedo weapons. I do have cash now. Money's flowing in. I missed what that, that uh, request was. Okay, first fleet's gonna hang out, hang out around there, and uh, that's good, good thing for them. They'll just defend. I'm sure we'll find some pirates before too long. Uh, what's the strength of that fleet? Well, it's not terrible. Two hundred. Not the worst. Okay, you're scouting over there. We've got this grasslands moon over here. What was the other the other desert planet? My new admiral in the fleet. Uh, this guy, Sandy Desert. You when you go ahead, you're on minus eleven also, so you're not very good also either. But you do have those furry beasts. Uh, the harmonious void has been detected. So we 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 found some um, some angry Wookies. These are pirates. They're over here. What is it? Do we see them? That right there. We got Angry Terror. Strength of 53, and we also have Nova of this. Now, so what he's saying basically is um, he's angry with us. He'll, he'll talk to us in a second. There it is. No, oh, in a second. He'll talk to us in a second, and he will say, hey, you know, be nice. Ooh, there's a bunch of them. He's saying, give us a lot of money and we won't kill you. Uh, they want to build a construction ship. Yeah, go build all that stuff. Um, hey, let's let's say we uh, let, don't, let's kill each other. How about... I can get protection agreement for 125 credits per month. They apparently don't want that treaty. We don't like you enough. No, no, no. We're, we're good friends. Look at all of them. Here I was thinking you guys were weak. But there's a lot of you. Oh, my research facility. You can't break that. What's that? My first fleet is there already. Good, good fight and action here. They're attempting to raid the research facility. They're looting and pillaging. How dare they? What you guys over here? We found uh, more. We found more pirates. The uh, the menacing marauders. Yeah, yeah. We know. Oh yeah, yeah. Go away. We've got company. 
Okay, so the the menacing marauders are saying, um, "Would be a shame if your ships or bases suffered harm." For a small fee of 125 credits, we can assure that our trigger-happy ship captains avoid damaging your vessels. Urge you to accept. Uh, okay, I accept. But that is not. You are the menacing marauders. But this, this is the har. No, who is this? The harmonious void. Are you different? You all look the same to me. We you know we're we're spider people and everything else that doesn't have eight legs. We're 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 not sure of. You just hate us, furious with us. Why do you hate us so much? They've raided our base. Then I already accept that one. Yeah, no, go away. Um, raided our base and but failed to obtain any loot. Good. Okay, they're attacking me. Uh, we don't even build build a navigator exploration chip that works. And we got a new spy, and they're attacking me. Okay, my here's my fleet. We're here to defend. They're attacking my uh, like my traders and uh, my scouts. Encountered a new pirate faction. One other pirate faction. I was just saying that last time I played. <laughs> when I was playing earlier today. I didn't. There was no pirates in, the, in my first system. Uh, hello. Uh, goodbye. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show me like see where you're on the map. Uh, leave me alone. We're all over the place. Okay, we've built our first military ship, the Kerbis Aggressor. There he is. Uh, I would like you to join the first fleet. The first fleet now has all four ships here, and one of them's kind of beat up, and they're going to get refueled. Looks like. You want to be to build exploration and an escort uh, for 5,000. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. The clan superiority offers us protection. She, yeah, yeah. Good idea. And then the... Um, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Okay, so all my money's going away to pirates now. So that 477 over here is how big their fleet is. And there's 124. Um, somewhere hanging around here. But it's not the guys that we, that we hate. They came to my main system, which we can fight that off. Over here, though, is just outrageous. But, where are they? Oh, they are still there. I need you guys. Is that them? I need you to destroy that guy. There you go. Go get them. They got little beam weapons. They ain't so tough. There's our is that our, there's we got shields, armor, and hull. You can see listed on this guy. On this guy. Blast them! Glad we put these guns on these research stations. This guy is disabled. I want you on that one. And I want you on that one. And you... That one. Okay, we got one damage, one low fuel. Can we, um... How much money we got? Can we get another escort? How much do they... I don't have money. My money's going to pay pirates to not shoot me. I don't know if this is, a, this is working. The whole s split up and fight tactic. Hey, we got stable warp fields. That's cool. We can leave the system now. So many of them. Uh, what, what if we just all, like, team up? Like, let's let's focus on that guy. Actually, I'm going to tell you guys... I don't want to give you any... Any other ideas? Just shoot these things. How you feeling, buddy? Shields are falling. Hmm. It'll be alright. Just kind of stick by this guy. We got... Who's this? Not my friend. But he's not the bad guys. The bad guys are the ones with the red. He is the uh, the guys we made friends with. 
Oh, he's no, he's not shooting him. He is shooting him. Okay. Well, good. What are you guys doing? We only got two ships left. I'm gonna put you guys back on defend, so you can go get yourself fixed up if you need to. Blasting these things. My guy's getting torched over here. New escort is done. Uh, can we get. Let's top up the fleet? Um, I want. E so everyone's. I need. I need you in the first fleet. First fleets. First fleets. Go, oh, research. Okay. Um I I need I would like to get the the uh the civilian ships. Ooh, star fighters would be kinda nice to have. But I think yeah, let's go ahead and get that first. Pirates won't be a problem much longer. I hope. Let's get that. We'll get we'll get um this will give us mining ships and passenger ships and fuel tankers money, basically, and colony ships. And then we'll work on something else. We're attacking it. The guy is disabled. My ships are called the same thing. Iron Renegade. I don't know if they stole it. How come they're not joining? How come when I say join the fleets? They're not joining the fleet. Is it because it's because of something automated about it? Uh, military. Manually controlled fleets will automatically repair. I, for manually controlled, I don't want them repairing. Fleet formation, fleet management. Automate top up ships for existing fleets. I will manage that. And home base, home bases, engagement ranges, and attack targets for fleets. I will manually deal with this stuff. That guy's broke. That guy's broken. The only guy really able to fight is this guy over here, wherever he is. There he is. So we're an 80, and this guy is, what, a 50 strength? Oh, he's an 80 strength also. However, we do have a shipyard here. You want to make, make an escort? Yeah, that's a good idea. Make some of those. Uh, you know what? Make make me a couple more of those. Make me one more of those. Get these pirates out of here. So everyone's all automated. You're all kind of broken with the problem. Yeah, everyone's broken and all messed up. That guy's real bad. Okay, we should be able to keep that safe. What's going on over here? That is, yeah, those, those are the bad guys who just showed up. Construction ship. You're going to right click to escort Kerbis Memory. Um, oh, where are you going? What's your mission? You're going to build this research station and fix it back up. Okay, good idea. Okay, what we got over here? Still coming in. They're still itching for a fight. Okay, new escort has been built. Where is he? Go get him. How's 
guy looking? Uh, he's... he's okay. Okay, we got two of them on this guy. Maybe we can handle him. Oh, he, got, he did get boarded. They boarded him. This, that was my ship. I thought it was my ship. They took it. Because they boarded it. That's dirty. I don't appreciate that. You guys, I'd like you guys to not, not die, please. My, I'm shooting my traitors now. All right, all right, all right. We'll, we'll get that one done first, but then let's get let's get something that can shoot stuff. Maybe an improved escort, probably would be better. Yeah, or a system patrol ship. Get a system patrol ship next. You can design, yeah, you can do all kinds of designing. Um, like a ridiculous amount of designing. My station's still fine. But they're over here blasting my, my friends. New escort's done. My trade ship! We've completed research on early beam weapons. Was I researching that? Uh, Xana evaded detection and successfully carried out their mission to steal research. Ah, oh, good job, buddy. He stole it from... I didn't, I didn't realize that was turned on automated. So my spy went in and stole some, some tech from these guys. Great. I like it. That's what you should have been doing three years ago. Okay, who's... Everyone's broken. This says he's under construction like, because of, because everything's down. This guy should be getting he should be getting destroyed by this this thing, the spaceport. And get him before he runs. Yeah, get him, buddy. Don't let him run. He's in bad. He's in bad shape. He's got no shields. He's got no hole. He's just. He's just a bunch of like duct tape and cardboard. But that doesn't stop him. We're angry spiders. I don't know if his weapons work or if he's just gonna have kind of a standoff here. This guy appears to be. Disabled, yeah. Another one coming in. Mine, my old one. Okay, hang in there, buddy. Got a uh, mineral miner in here. We can even go in, like, we can click on this guy and we can go view from the bridge camera. Look at that. Watch his downfall. As he buzzes by the crabs. We can go with the behind, behind camera. Uh, he's right down here. We've got a low angle, which we saw that one. We've got the high angle. There. Top down. We've got just the default angle. Where'd he go? Did he run away? Yeah. And then we got the free form, which we've been looking at. Okay, Dark Moon is here. Oh, nice way to nice nice entrance, buddy. All right. So we're gonna deal with that. We got just 61 over here. 
Where's that at? Oh, yeah, you over here. Oh, you guys are all broken over here? Are you fixed yet? We need a construction ship over here to get this guy taken care of. I can take that. A dad joke. Um, so in 55 AD, we're going, we're going historical today. This doctor uh, had performed. Hang on, hang on, I'm, I'm distracted here. Uh, this doctor performed uh, brain surgery on the uh, the emperor of, of Rome. It was, he was the world's first neurosurgeon. A little bit of a stretch, but you you know where it's going. You you get it. Are you broken? Somebody break that. Why are all my ships broken? <laughs> yeah, we're great. We're great. Everything's fine. <laughs> I would call this game a mix of Stellaris and Aurora 4X. Does that, that seem fair? For those of you that have, that have played more than me of the two. You're disabled. Your construction ship. You're going to go build this guy back up, which we need. Uh, do it before this guy shows up and gets angry. These both look familiar, don't they? Found some resources in Ihuhiksad. Where's that at? We need a different system. Oh, look at that. We Look at all the explorer. I'm so, like, caught up in these, these pirates. Look at all the exploring we've been doing. We're out bouncing around. Like, forget all this horrible things at home. Let's go explore. So we've, we've explored a few things here. And that is a different color. There's a couple different colors here. So we've, we've seen other folk um, out there. Anyway, back to my system. All right. Um, so when that gets done, which is almost done, that's civilian ships. Which we've done in 10 days. And then we can get some colonizing done if we if we decide that colonizing needs to be happening. Um, the only other one that we've got that, that like is doable is this other continental one we've got over there, which isn't terrible. I, I'm okay with that. Uh, but most importantly, it'll give us mining ships and things. Where's this at? This is over at the ice planet. Our construction ship's trying to fix this guy, but he cannot because he keeps on getting attacked. But the station's back up and running, so maybe we can take this guy out. My guy. My guy out. So when we get a colony ship, we can go build that. Under attack, under attack. What do we got? Oh, yeah, yeah. This one? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to get a colony ship and we'll go send him over there. Um, can I order colony ship? I don't think I... Yeah, I, I... Is that all done with... I don't know that I... I don't remember if I can. I forget. I need colony ships research and the basic colony module. I need this one. Oh, right, and the mod... Yeah, the module. I forget where it is. Yeah, I remember that now. There it is. Yeah, I forgot about that. So we'll, um, we'll add that to the list. Right, so we have we don't make the ships. We don't have to put the modules on them yet, though. So we can actually can't colonize. I forgot about that. Okay. That my guys uh, there. There's one of theirs still. Trying to raid my sis my station. We have anyone that can fix that can fight? No. Um. Can we make? 
Why don't you give me a couple more construction ships? One more construction ship. Um, there's a ground, there's a ground battle right there attacking me on the planet. Okay, so there's 131 of them here attacking me, but my whole planet is defending this. I don't think I've ever seen pirates attack my base like that before. I've never seen some pirates. I, 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 I remember that, like one of the things I read about this, these recent updates, is that pirates have been toned down. Don't worry about pirates. There's a couple pirates fighting each other. Um, you're under attack. Yeah, you're being raided. Okay, it's okay. We're killing them, though. It's fine. We got, we got, uh, remember that general I said was not going to do, Mad Dog? That wasn't going to do anything? Well, he's doing something. He's fighting off these, these dang Wookiees. Dang Wookiees. Here comes a couple more coming in to raid us. But I can't do anything about it. Am I going to lose to pirates, like, immediately? Ground battle rages at the colony. Yeah, I know. We keep landing people though. Um, like we've got we've got ships. They just need to get fixed. Where's this one at? Under construction. He's almost. He's getting fixed. Old Kerbis here is taking care of him. We'll get this guy back. There is a, a... Oh, that's the other guy that's disabled over there. They <laughs> they won, and they successfully raided my my colony. Okay. <laughs> Can we, okay. It'll be okay. You know, um, a lot of great empires had their capital sacked, you know, early on. Um, and, you know, typically things ended up okay after a while. Things will be all right. I know. I don't even see what they took. More than I wanted them to take, though. They're just attacking me because I'm a dumb name. It took 7,000? Oh, you know I had 7,000. Mining ship, mining ship. Okay, construction ship is done. Buddy, have I got some work for you. I don't know where you are, but there's a lot of things I need fixed. Let's cover some hidden items at Noor's. Some sulfur caverns. Okay, that's good. This is patrol ships is done. Excellent. Uh, construction ship is done. Yeah, he's going to go out and do some building. Uh, can I tell them? Oh, I'm not sure if those are the ones I can actually make. Those, those patrol ships. Construction ships. You are working on the spaceport. You're working on the gat guy. You're escaping and you're leaving the construction yard. Can I have you go? I probably should put you somewhere. Was gonna do some some help. Um. Look at this frigate here. If I had money, I would buy one of these. Um, I will bump up a uh, an escort real quick. Where's that one at? Small system out here. We met anyone else out there? I haven't seen anyone else pop up there. It's just these these pirates. Yeah, just pirates so far. No independence. We got some spies. And they are doing counterintelligence. This guy's not very good, but this guy's good at, well, espionage. They never asked for money. I tried, I tried to pay them. I said, please take my money. And they said, we don't like you. I'm sorry. But we hate you, and so we're gonna we're gonna attack you. Okay, they want to build a mining station out this way. Uh, we're short on all these resources. Uh, sure. Yeah. Dang it. Wookiees. That's what that should say. <laughs> Is my escort done yet? He's getting fixed up. Everyone's broken. Oh, are you one right there? Are you getting fixed up? Go f fix that.
What are you shooting at? You're shooting through the planet. Get him, get him fixed up, please, Mr. Crab. I want you to... Oh, we found an abandoned base, huh? Oh, repair it, repair it. Excellent. Uh, you know, buddy, I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't... Just, just... I need you to go... Do your thing. All right, let's investigate that that station. What do we download? Team enters the base. It automatically in initiates a wipe of the central computer core. We only have time to download one piece of information. Either the location of a nearby independent colony or a mysterious set of galactic coordinates. I want some galactic coordinates. We investigated it. It appears to be in good working order, and then we've bored it and taken control. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is in Kerbis. Oh, that's that one. Oh, cool. Alright. Thunderstrike, thanks for the sub. Anything else over here now? Oh, what are you doing here? Ay, ay, ay. Maybe he'll just leave. He's a space monster. We don't like space monsters. Maybe maybe he's just here to just all say hello. Maybe he's a friendly space monster. Maybe he's just trying to make babies or something. Okay, how's that how's that ship construction going? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> how how uh, how bad can can it get? Like, what's that? You got you don't like three pirates? How about how about a space monster? <laughs> go get him! Go get him! Shoot him in the back. We're gonna go with the bridge view and see how this. Oh, he took off. Okay. Well, you scared him. You scared him away. All right, well, those are under control. Um, we could probably just hang out here for a while. Back to normal things. So there's one over here that needs cleaning up. He disabled, but uh, Dark Moon's got it. Any more around here? That fight. I think that's it. You just have this, what's going on over here. Well, something over here. Oh, just that guy, but we don't care about him. Supreme Bastion, are you back up and running, buddy? Just need to tow you back back to home so you can get fixed up. And then maybe we'll get someone that has more than a little thirteen strength. Discovered a new uh, items at Noor's. What's with this Noor's place? Oh, I don't want to deal with that. What are you going there for? Don't go there. You're leaving, right? They don't attack it. What are you doing? You're jumping, right? You're leaving? Why does it say he's attacking? Okay, yeah, he's leaving. No, he is. What are you doing? Why would they go there and attack that? This is a terrible idea. He's going to chew your little face off. Buddy. Alright. Um, I need you to escape. It's a, it's a good show and all, but he's, look, he's, you got him screaming at us now. Please, please go. He's getting glowy. I'll deal with the ood here in a second. As soon as I take the paws off, <laughs> if I pause them. Run, buddy, run! You're not running fast enough. No, you're disabled. See? Why would he go there? <laughs> Why would he try to attack that? We encounter the ood! Alright. Uh, show me. Where? Where are we see him at? You're not welcome here. Speak quickly. 
Uh, hello. They don't like me very much. But you know what? That's fine. No one likes me. So we found some Securins as well. Who are well. Uh, where? I want to see. Show me. I want to show me on the map. They're naturally hostile, hostile towards us. Everyone's going to be kind of hostile towards us. We found some humans out there as well. Uh, we found a lone trade ship. Out this way. Where are we at here? Ocean planets. Nice. Oh, that's where the Ood are. Out this way. There's the Securin. And then we've got, of course, there's pirates around. And, oh, is that is that the pirate, like, home base over this way? Yeah, we hate those guys. That's That's the pirates over there. And then there's a beacon of that. I think that's where our data thing was telling us was over here. It was like a, a spot. Uh, where's the humans at? Not sure where the human colony is. Okay, scenery there. We we saw them. Traders tell us nearby colony over there, which we that's what we talked to over there. We don't know where you are. You are. Oh, you're the main, you're the big, big boys. Okay. I will kill you soon enough. But, uh, after I deal with pirates. Sorry, that nation's, are they, are they in? I don't, I don't see them. All right, back to, back to this. There's a bunch of them back. Wait, these are these are different people. You're the bad guys. Dark Moon is over there trying to handle this. Okay, we see those. Yep, yep, I don't care about that so much. Um, any ships ready to fight? Supreme Bastion's doing alright. Dark Moon's not doing well. Let's get... Bastion, get over here. Are you getting fixed up? Oh, you're getting fixed up right now. I'm going to leave you alone. This one over here. Oh, we found the uh, the hive, the Pikean hive. There they are. Also found a new empire in the Nemanarini system. Found another alien race, the uh, Hakonish. Okay. There it is. That's me. There's a spaceport. Okay, that's... It's fine that these guys... Oh, those are guys are, we don't like... Taken off. That guy's under attack by the menacing marauders, but he just, he just took off. Okay. Now, discovered a new resource of Beta Coppola at Beta Coppola with some, some leaves. Okay, and the Buscar. Man, a base is uh, discovered in here. Let's go investigate it. Small state port, lightly damaged, currently inoperable. We could acquire it. Where's this one at? This is in... Oh, way over there. Okay. What else is out there exploring some things? And if I had some money coming in, um, I'd be in better shape. Okay, this guy's actually in good shape. He's a 75, so he's he is full strength, mostly. I'm guessing he's going back to get repaired. Yeah, he's he's back up. He's gonna come try to help out with this. We complete the of advantage ship. And yeah, go go fix that up. Dark Moon's under attack, but it's here, so it should be within range of this guy. Not quite. There he goes. He's trying to raid. Uh, 
There, uh, there's a big in in the first distant worlds. There's a there's a big Star Trek mon. So Dark Moon and Bastion seem to be in good shape. Where's Dark Moon at? Oh, he's not in good shape. He needs to get fixed. They're both both going for Prime Encounter, which is this guy hanging out around my base here, my my system. They'll that they'll get fixed up in a minute. Just pirates. How bad can they be? That guy's going to hang out over there for a while. They've... Apparently they raided my base. And they took what? I took a bunch of my Krypton. How'd they get through there? Supreme Bastion got taken over. I don't know what to do about these pirates. They don't want to be my... Fr I can't pay them off. He's disabled. Yeah. In the abyss. Boarded and captured. They keep boarding me and, and capturing my ships. Not much I can do about it until I get more tech. We're, we're getting colonization, which I don't know if it's going to be much good. And then we'll get, we'll get some weapons tech. As soon as that's done. Hello, Dew Village. Yeah, my ships are garbage. But what, what am I going to do, you know? Um, I've, like, I'm in the very beginning of the game. I haven't even got... I don't even know how to colonize planet yet. Trying to board my spaceport now. Uh, mining station, sure. Build escort ship. Good idea. Okay. We have the colonization technology. Hooray! Okay, so let's go get some weapons. We can get... We can get weapons. We can get shields. What do we want? Ground combat. Engines maneuvering. There's plating. Countermeasures. I want crew systems. Um, armor plating is actually we're actually nearly done with armor plating. Let's go ahead and get that started up. We crash for 2600 but I think we're all how much it doesn't say how long how long for this one does it 56 days that's not too long let's just do the 56 days get that done and then we'll get some shields in there I think I may crash that one how much six thousand bucks to crash I don't I'm not, I can't do that so we'll let it so we'll let it go I'm trying to board my station here Crashing has the time. It also removes any, like, chances of things stopping it. So we could hit, like, 87% and then it all ends. But the planning will be done in 17 days. And you want to make a frigate. Yeah, go for it. Careful stealth's having a bad day. Um, yeah, that's probably a good idea. Another escort. If we got the money, let's do it. Um, exploration ship's getting hit by that guy. Uh, plating is done. Okay, good. And then another station. Yeah, that gives money. It costs money, but it'll give us money. Is this guy getting attacked? It's just an exploration ship. He should be able to get out of there. Oh, is this another one? Oh, yeah, there's another one here at the star. Colony's under attack. They have been beaten back. Menacing Motors offers protection. Yes, please. So we encountered an exploration ship adrift. Uh, let's investigate it. Where's this at? We went to, I still know we sent someone over here to go look at it. This is out, way out this way. Okay, uh, investigate. It's slightly damaged and currently inoperable. We could acquire it by sending construction, construction ships. Please do so. Energy deflectors is done already. You're attacking my colony. That guy's getting attacked. That goes away. Okay, and a new escort has been completed. Now, let's get, get ion weapons. We can get tractor beams. Let's just get some, like, um, what are we good at? I forget what we're... Aren't we good at... 
Are we good at just all weapons? I forget. Let me, let me look and see what we're, what we're good at. Uh, I think it's in... Where is it at? Here? What do you want? You want to build a frigate? Go ahead. Um, let's see. We are in... Government. Troop equipment right. Espionage. React research is really good. Um... Sensor, reactor, hyperdrive. Okay, nothing. Oh, weapons. Oh, just weapons just in general is 13. Okay. So let's just get... We'll get the ones that we've got a little bit in, which I guess is just pulse blast. It should take almost two years. You like torpedoes? Like these guys? It'll take a long time to get done. We could just quickly whip up some, like, some missiles. What's the, what's the fast thing we can get done? Let's stick with torpedoes. Let's get those things done. And I wonder if it's a good idea to... We can do one concurrent. Okay. All right. We have the tech to go colonize. So, uh, not that we have the money really to do it, but we're going to get... Hey, we got a new frigate. Oh, we got a new guy too. Let's see him. Come on out, buddy. Come on out. Where are you? Dark Serpent under attack. By my old friend. Yeah. Where's my new guy at? Was that a traitor? Yeah. There he is. Wolf of Kerbus. He's cool looking. Look at that guy. Wow. Cool. Alright. Go shoot some things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good idea. Good idea. Escort, yes, please. What's his uh what's his strength? Why is it so bad? Why doesn't he have any hull or armor? The rampage of Kerbis is here. This guy's... Oh, this is the guy getting built right now. Why don't you... He's attacking this guy. Um... Why don't you go get refit? This guy's out now. You are refueling. Uh, go retrofit you. I'm going to send everyone out to get, get retrofit. This guy's new guy is done. Which is Rampage here. Who is getting shields? We has he has shields. Okay, so we got we got one. His strength is garbage. Okay, torpedoes are coming up next. New escort is complete. Bill, yeah, go ahead and get me some ships out there. Okay, we got one coming in, but we can we can take him out, surely. The abandoned ship has been repaired. Oh, good. Uh, where's this at? Nice. You should be good, right? Yeah, you're good. Let's investigate it. Abandoned ship. Appears to be good working order. We've boarded it and taken control. Disassembling the advanced technology in the ship has one of our spaceports would yield research bonuses. Or we could keep it. Okay. I'd like to keep it. 
Uh, oh, you're awesome. You're an exploration ship. But you actually... Not bad. So the clan of superiority offers to sell some secret information. They want to... They're going to offer us a map for 4200 bucks. I'm going to say no. Because I don't care about your dang maps. That guy's done. That guy's done. Let's see if we can talk. So, like these guys... Um, we hate... We don't like them either, but they have a protection thing with these guys. Uh, these fellas are the ones that have been kind of fighting along with us. You're set by your attacks against our ships. I didn't attack you. Um, can we get a deal of, like... I don't care about that. Um, I don't want that. What about... What kind of treaty can we do with you? I can just cancel. Non-aggression is... Um, we have to, they have to like us a little more. They don't like us. Alright. Continue on. Um, I would like to colonize. That one's got people on it. This is probably the best one. It's in Kerbis. Let's go build a colony ship and go build over there. Let's get a second colony set up here. While we were trying to fight this stuff away. Supreme Bastion is chasing us down. But Wolf of Corbus is here. Wolf of Kerbis is here. Get him, buddy! Come on. Don't fail me. Don't let him board you. You coming in here? Okay. Let me out here. Okay, cool, cool. Man, they're ever they're just they just don't stop coming. Wolf of Corvus is disabled. <laughs> uh, <laughs> maybe we can like maybe maybe they'll like like hey, I'll give you money. Stop it! Please! What? Uh, they don't like you enough. They don't like you to take enough to take your money. <laughs> you guys are the worst. Where's this at? My void. Yeah, it's been under attack. And evaded detection of stealing. Research on tractor beams. Alright, I'll, I'll take that. I'll take that. What a rough game. Good bonuses to slavery income and have unique techs for buildings and increase it further. Don't let local inhabitants stop you from having that planet. See, at the moment, we're having some other problems. I would love to go, uh, you know, say hello over there. What if we can, think we can get away with it right now? Like, send it, send that colony ship over there? We could try it. Like, if I were to come over here and colonize this one... 0% success. They will resist colonization when your relations are with them are low. You can improve it before going over there. So we have to go and like, um, you know, we have to let them know that we're gonna we're gonna go live there with ships. Come some trade coming in, but there's the fighting. He got he got it just barely in time. How are we looking here? Everything kind of garbage. You kill the base, all remaining pirate ships join you. So if I go in and ready, Look, if, you, if you guys are alive. Get in the second fleet. Okay, so your job here is just to defend. Okay? The entire fleet, seven ships, 86 defense uh, power. Garbage. Okay, wait, what do we got over here? Hang on, hang on. Uh, torpedoes tech is done. Excellent. We can... You want to go build um, a, a mining colony over there? 
and there. Um, okay. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's good. You want to build a fuel tanker. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. You're going to give me a map for some money. I don't want to do that. You, more mining. Yep. And Mad Dog evaded and stole a territory map of the Pike and the Hive. Oh, yeah, what'd you get? Over here? Yeah, Pike and other are like a main faction, right? Yeah. So we have them, the, the Namarini and the Umbara. Nobody likes us, but it's okay. We don't like them either, so it makes sense. We're exploring Beta Capital apparently at the moment. Okay. For one moment, there's no fighting going on. We know where their base is, right? They are here. 160 is our strength. You think we could, like, once we get our fleet, like, repaired, if they give me a moment of peace and we get repaired, you think we could take that out? We found some humans. Countered an independent colony of humans at, at ancient slave colony. Naturally very hostile towards us. Where? Oh, I don't want to do that. I, I, I keep looking for show me to tell me where that's on the map. Humans. There it is. Humans. Two billion of them. Out there. Okay, humans. Yeah, build one of those. We are under attack. Exploration. Oh, it's exploration guy. Fuel taker complete. Um, research. So let's get mm, enhanced torpedoes. That's seven years. Let's just get some like. Um, We'll get some tractor beams. We've almost really got a little bit into there. It's not too long. Let's get a point defense. An accurate point defense, you know. That's probably better. Uh, and then let's go look at a little bit more. Oh, maneuvering might be kind of nice to have. And later army costs too much. Missing some steel for that. Star fighters. But we need a ship that can hold them. Proton ionization. Oh, yeah, get that. Oh, we can't. What do we need? Steel. Okay. There's somebody hanging out over here. But because we're all one fleet now, now that we finally be able to do that. Second fleet, second fleet. Um, I want you to be in second fleet also. And then the Kerbis mystery is broken. So we'll put, him, we'll put him in there, though. There no longer is a, a first fleet. There's just second fleet. <laughs> I know. Imagine a planet with two billion civilians, two billion humans. Disgusting. We got some shipboarding tech. That is a tech I would like to have. Where is that one at? That's already got shipboarding. Yeah, that's that's good stuff. Does that mean that we assault pods? Yeah. All right, that's going, and then we get that one next. Once we get some steel, we gotta get some steel. I think we've got a mine that does it. Yeah, we have a shortage of, of steel here. Hmm. Ivory. I know we've got. I know we've got some coming in. So yeah, there's some. Um, we're just not making enough. Okay, we got some more missile weapon technology. Excellent. Spies are doing a good job. That's what we do. That's, we're, we're pretty good spy people. Let's see if we can actually make it out of this system. And then we're taking it, taking the fight to them. Tractor beam research is done. Okay. Uh, now we're working on point defense. And in order to take a planet, we need... Um, not passenger ships. What's it? Troop transports is what we need. Before that, we need to get basic military starships. We've got that one. And 21 steel. Then we can get that one, and we can build some troop transports and head over there. 
I'm assuming they're at... Are they at a planet? How does that work? I forget how the pirate bases work. Do we even know where they are? I don't think we even know. We just know they're around here, right? Is that the right one? No, it's here. Okay, there it is. Oh, is it just a base? It's not a planet. It's just a base. Strength of 238. That might be doable. Um, your mission at the moment is to retrofit. Because I think we've got everything. Well, we'll wait. I'll we'll go ahead and set it up. Let's get fitted out and get you set up. Um, where's that colony ship at? Are we building that colony ship? Did we ever build that thing? Where is it over? It's over... Not there. Here. I don't remember where it was. Uh, mining station, yeah. Ooh, that's good Good steel. And the Kerbis system, too. Perfect. I don't remember where our colonies would be going. Uh, that one. So we're working on it. Mars are going to sell us some maps, but I don't want your maps because I got no money. Uh, oh, they're, they're, well, they're mining. This is colony development and population growth bonus. Completely explored. I guess it's. I guess the exploration level uh, is based on the planet. How much is actually there? Had a coffee. Outrageous. All right. So him. I'll take a scout. Mad Dog got me some rapid point defense. Excellent, buddy. Mad Dog is the hero here. And we discovered an ancient slave colony which has new resources over there. Okay. Does that mean? I'm assuming that they're like an independent people. Assuming it's how that is. Can I take this ship? I don't want to like make him mad, but I'd like to take it. Okay. And other than that, there's the ancient slave colony there. Independent nation, yeah. Are you selling me? Maps. Okay, new escort done. A gift. Wait. You're advising me that I give them that much money? That's a stupid idea. So fire that guy right now. I got a ton of money. Where did all that money come from? Uh, let's use it. I would like to fast that. And let's get the point defense done. And the maneuvering. And then we'll get some transports. Are you going to fight this thing again? I don't understand why they're doing that. No, no. Join the second fleet and get out of there. Bones invasion on the colony is set to peacefully colonize instead of invade. When you get transports, it will switch to invade for all of them. No more gift recommendations. That seems like a good spot. Oh, because we're trying, we're trying to like make them happy and then get them. I get it. We're trying to like make them like us, so then we can just peacefully take their stuff. So in um, intelligence is all automated. We learn how to talk to these guys. Wait, did we steal something? Yeah, we stole something. 
stuff over there. We have our tech done. Was that second fleet? What? Send second fleet to prepare and a, an attack defender of here. Where's that at? Down here. Oh, you want me to go there? You ready for me to fight there? I don't think I'm ready for that yet. Okay. Some things at Kerbis 3. Still find lots of stuff in my main system here. No, don't do that. I will send my fleet to here, though. See if you can hang on here until my fleet shows up. Yeah, it's just, it's to go there and attack a ship, I know. Barely get any loot. They're running off. As we arrive, they're running, they're gonna run off. Um, I changed my mind, I think I need you guys back. Go, go, go back. Man, dog got some more tech. All right, maneuvering is almost done. Put you guys over here. This is where all the money's coming in at. Two candles meet up. One asks the other, what are you doing today? And the other candle replied, oh, I'm going out. <laughs> Advanced deflectors. That sounds like an idea. There's ship boarding. I'm going to go ahead and get that one. Yeah. And then where's my... Um... Oh, I need... So I still need... What for this? Shipboarding. Oh, I need shipboarding first. And then we can get that one. Okay. There's the resort stations and the large mining stations. Maybe good for good for money. However. I'd like to not die. Build a fleet first. Amazing how much money shows up whenever you're not getting attacked every three seconds. It's only some maps. I don't want those. What's the strength of my fleet now? 258. Mining station. That's good. Completed the rapid point defense. Working on the ship boarding thing now. Okay. That puts us up to 258. I'm not sure if there's any retrofitting to be done, but we'll do a little bit there. And that's done. We got some zero G combats started up. Uh, what's that? So there's zero G right there. Ionization engines. Engines are bigger. It takes crew to, to run, but goes a lot faster. You want to build an escort? Yeah, I'll build an escort. A mining station. Anytime you guys see a mining station, you go for it. I could just put it on automated. Um, okay. Yep. And I think I will. So, if... Where's where construction? Base construction. If you want to build a base, you go right ahead. Repairing abandoned things, go right ahead. And I'll also just and then execute the ship construction if I miss it, no big deal. Okay, so shipboarding is done. We got we got pods for that. Now we have the colony ship is complete. He's gonna go build his colony. And they want me to give him money. No. 
Okay, here's the um, is it the mining stations for the for the asteroids? Yeah. So it is the same station, isn't it? That's what that's what all these are here. What'd you guess? Point defense and escorts are being made. Um, a fleet is now at 325. I don't know that we can handle that that big fleet, but I kind of want to. Let's it, get some more ships in there. Let's top it up. Let's get a real a real fleet here. And you're gonna be a uh, an, I can put you on attack. I'm not gonna do it just yet. I'm gonna leave you on defense so you don't go running off. New colony has been founded. Hooray! Yay! A plus sixteen, not the best, but it'll it'll get there. We'll, we'll take care of it. We'll get we're getting we're losing a lot of money here right now. There's some corruption. People are it's twenty percent developed, twenty one percent. So that'll go up. Build frigates. Okay, that one's been done. And uh, Mad Dog is just a mad dog. Mad Dog is a hero. Yeah, your fleets. Uh, so you can design your fleets. Um, let's see if I remember how to do this. Um, this one. So fleet templates. We can set what we've got in here, and, and yeah, we can we can mess with all this stuff. I'm not gonna do this yet. But we can we can tweak what is an escort frigate, all that kind of thing. What'd you find? Ah, uh, look. Neat. We have found some. Oh, we found the Wookies. Encountered a new empire in the Beta Coppola system. Oh, in that system, they are Wookies. Show me. You dare come before us? This had better be good. He's doing something with his hands there. Um, we declare war on you. No. Okay. Uh, dismiss. All right, we found the Wookies. There they are. All right? Is that no? That, that's not them. That's me. They are here in beta. I don't know where they are. There they are. Somewhere around here. There's no system. There's nothing there. Okay, new forget completes. Uh, I don't want that. I don't want your ruins. Uh, I'm not going to give you any money. Sure. Lots of resources coming in. Uh, Zandu is starting to steal some stuff too. We got some rail gunnery. Ice caverns. Yeah, they're up, they're up this way now. Space is getting a little more exciting. Not too far behind. No one else has any has multiple like systems though, so I'm I'm okay with that. Everyone's just all stuck at one spot. It seems like got a new ambassador has shown up, and the fuel tanker is complete, uh, which should go. Is it going in here? Yeah, we got two fuel tankers in there. So we're up to a strength of 700, and that is seems pretty good. So let's go. Let's go take them out. What do you want me to build? Escort. I like it. And I'm not going to do that. Okay, so they are here, right? Strength of 690. Oh, our fleet is 690. There is 238. Okay, so I'm going to send you guys. We're going to go right here. And uh, we're going to kind of build up over this way, and then we're going to go get them. Now, no one else attack me while this is happening, okay? Because uh, it would be real bad if you did. So away the fleet goes. Let's watch. I'm going to take this guy. We're going to look through his bridge camera. Which is kind of boring. His. Well. <laughs> I think we missed him. Yeah, there he is. There he goes. So away they go. Payback time. That's right. Remember those years that you just bombed me for no reason? Well, I gotta turn pr proposed gifts off. Uh, diplomacy, offering gifts, manual. Harmonious voice is offering up protection. You, I hate you. 
Uh, do we have any, any ships that aren't in this fleet? Yeah, we... Oh, hang on. Okay, so I don't want you going to attack that thing. Please stop it. Escape from Gravelex. I'm going to go ahead and make you into a new fleet. I'm going to add this guy into there. Sly Turmoil. And go into that um, third fleet. Just to have a defense fleet. And I, what I want the third fleet to be is a defense fleet. And you can go ahead and top up with uh, some frigates there. That's good. Okay, second fleet is on their way. The defense fleet is is uh, is had enough. The best defense is destroying the base. It's a good offense or whatever. We found some Actarians, very hostile towards us. Not terrible though. Actually, they don't mind us so much. They're they're, they're um. Not so bad at all. For a mission against us, managed to escape our forces after stealing our maps. That's okay, I don't care if you take my maps. More frigates getting built. So we're gonna dock here on the edge, and then we're gonna and then we're gonna go in. I like the sound of that. I would like to invade that place. All right. Then we gotta go deal with that guy when we're done. I don't think they have any ships left. They just have a station. Okay, second fleet. Go ahead and come on in here. All right, so slow it down. Okay, here we go. Crank the music. Here we come. We warp in. Shattering night. That's not the only thing going to be shattered. I have no troops, but we don't need troops. We're just going to blow everything up. We're bad in their range. He may destroy all of us. I wouldn't be surprised if that's, what, if that's what's going to happen here. Yeah, they're pretty automated. There's not a whole lot you can do. Just sort of... I'm manually telling them to attack. That's about it. Ah, and his range? Why isn't he shooting? Something out there. There's one of them. This is going down pretty quick. Get a good camera here. Bridge camera. Here we go. This is it. The whole night has led up to this. As long as we destroy this station, then I then I say we won. Uh, where is that? I know we can change our tactics with with um. This is this guy's tactics specifically. And then on the fleet, we can change it. Where are uh, where are the attack fleet? That's our, that's our template. Our tactics are here. Current position within fleet. Uh, you were fleet as, as needed. Formation. Uh, is tight better? Better overlapping point defense. Okay. Go tight. Yeah, go tight. Now we just sort of sit back. Uh, go back. Freeform. Ooh, he's getting kind of nasty. Oh! We're going to win. Did we lose anybody? We 
completely destroyed the Harmonious Void. After destroying them, some foreign ships have joined us. Two ships have just... There's only two ships left? Alright. Uh, so you guys need to go... What are you on manual? Yes, uh, you go back. Really? We got a little beat up, but not too bad. You're going to be on a defense fleet. Actually, I could just stitch on, on attack. They're going to go back and get refuel, refuel, but then they'll go out and do whatever um, we decide. And so, like, if there's anything that needs, needs killing, they can go do that on their own. They'll, they'll manage it. I'm not opposed to that. I would, however, like to take that. Take this. Your empire will prepare to invade and take the independent colony by force when we are able, and that's our that's our automated thing, and I'm fine with that. I'm fine with taking everybody out. We found some temples, Temple of Kerbis. We found some good colony bonuses there. Where is it? And fifty thousand? What? We just spent fifty thousand bucks. Where? On this planet? It's a terrible place. We'll find other bonuses if we if we live. We should just well we gotta get uh research there. Fifty thousand bucks. Build a fuel tanker. <clears throat> How's our research looking? Uh what what are we at here? We are at 50-50 at the moment. Look at all that money. Yeah, build a ship. Um, why don't we... Like we're losing money, but the, um, the private is making big money for me. So... I only know how to make, make frigates. Uh... Let's just do some. Let's do some colonizing real quick. See, wait, wait, what, what can we colonize? This one's only a plus ten. It's a desert savanna though, so that's not terrible. Let's just go over there, since that's that's the other, only other one that's really doable for us. We'll build the ship up, send them out that way. Um, there's always things attacking me, and that guy's still out here. And I think we can take him with this fleet now. 700 or, or thereabouts. What, what's your strength, buddy? 900, so we can't quite get him just yet. We might be able to with this. We actually might be able to, but... Because all his firepower is going to go on one guy. So we actually might be able to handle him, but we'll wait a minute. Because we'll get new new armor, and then we'll refit that fleet. Uh, and maybe we build another fleet. we got two fleets at the moment. And we do have some ships that I think are not... Are we part of a fleet? You aren't the Great Emperor. You're escorting Charming Starway out there. You're nothing, you're nothing fancy, Great Emperor, but with a name like Great Emperor, I think you're going to be your own fleet. So the fourth fleet. And what I want the fourth fleet to do is I want you guys to be a... Invasion fleet. I think we. I think we have the. Did we get the transport tech? Oh, we didn't. Okay. Do we need for this yet? What do we need? Shipboarding, basic transport, tra basic transport systems. Where's that at? Is there a search? Basic medical systems, transport systems. Okay. That one, and then can I can I um crash that one? How much is it? Fifty nine. I have lost a lot of money. Well, I think I'm thinking I want. So we need a we need a defense fleet, we need an attack fleet, and we need an invasion fleet. So we'll let the one kind of hang out in the back. And the other two can go bounce around. Oh well, the other one will the other two will kind of stick together here. You got some exploration scanners from the Wookiees, and we have exploration scanner research com oh enough to get it complete. Nice. 
So you guys are all heading back here to refuel. Third Fleet has no mission, which you are just... Your job is just to sit in Kerbis and defend. That's fine. Fourth Fleet, you shouldn't be on manual. Um, you are going to be my invasion fleet. But I want you to hang out in Kerbis, though. Yeah, okay, you're going back. Okay. These six ships... I'm not really sure what to, what to do with you. Um, the Pakian have... How many systems you got? You got a couple there. Like, we can never take out this planet because we have to invade it. And that's kind of a pain. Difficult. I don't even know what you've got other than, other than that. Yeah, I'm sure you've got... I'm sure you've got a decent amount of, of ships and things. What kind of planets do you like? Volcanic? If we find someone that likes that likes the same planets that we do, that'd be nice. I think we gotta go for these guys next. Yeah, I think they I think they're gonna be the ones we gotta go for next. People like this place. Uh, where's this at? This is very far away. Oh, yeah, it's kind of far away. Okay, they're all heading in. Let's crimp the speed here. There's neutron star. There's nothing, nothing in these places worth colonizing. Uh, Kerbis 4 is still losing us some money, but everyone loves living here. Uh, in this system, what, do we have anything we can make here? Oh, no facilities. Oh, do we have anything we can make here? No. No maps. And got some enhanced missiles. Missiles. Seven years for that armor. Can I can I buy that? Fifty four thousand to to crash this. That's a lot of money. Eight years. Long time for that. Okay, that's not this guy, but I would like to get rid of this guy if we can. Okay, everyone's already loaded up as, as best as they can be. You guys got no fuel. When they get done, they might actually go on their own to attack this. Yes, it's a tax rate, so everyone's like barely... Uh, that place make their barely happy. I'll leave it as it is. Because I'll just forget. I'll, I'll forget that I set it up, and then people will get all cranky. Uh, there's a threat in the LR-114. Aliens? What's, what's, um, what's the name of the planet in Alien? Um, L2, L, I forget, I forget. Where's that at? I wish you would, I wish you would tell me. Oh, there it is. No, I don't care about it. All right, because all it is is it's just, a, it's just a star. There's no reason to go there. Unknown ancient ruins for 10,000. No. LZ. What is it? LZ42. I can't, I can't remember it now. <laughs> 2.6 billion of us. LV426. Okay, LV.
There's a lot of people here. That's actually um, lots of folks are hanging around here. It'd be nice, but it's, it is so far away. I'm not sure if we'll be able to get there. More things at Beta Capital. That seems like a good system there. Um, it really wants me to go take out that thing. I'm not going to investigate that. We found some gemstones over there. And some fuzzy bushes. Mad Dog is stealing stuff again. Mad Dog, if you ever die, we'll be in trouble. Or if you ever get assassinated, it's more likely what's going to happen to him. Okay, we're going to try this. I'm not sure if we can handle this guy, but we're going to go for it. We might lose a whole fleet in this. But... You only fight Gravelex once. Okay, let's go... Go get him. Okay, this should be an interesting fight. So he should be, like, focus on... Well, I'm sure we'll lose some ships. He's going to focus on one. I'm hoping that we can destroy him. Look at that fleet coming in. He's screaming at us. Through the rings. Seems to be missing, though. Here comes the torpedoes. Oh, that was a good hit. Oh, yeah, no problem. <laughs> okay. That guy just warped space or something along the way. As he, <laughs> as he died. We got him! Okay. Good job, everybody. Pat yourselves on the back. Um, get, get back and go get fixed up if you need it. That wasn't a problem at all. I didn't lose anybody. I'm going to buy... It's expensive, but I'm going to buy it to get that thing done. Is there anyone that's that close to us? Early area weapons tech is done because of old Zandu over here. We're doing some really good stealing of things. I haven't messed with that really at all. It's all automated. I've only got two spies, but they're heroes. Researching things on basic, basic uh, diplomacy. I don't want to mess with it because they're doing so well. Bunch of characters around here. Um, oh, I guess you get some more spies. He's corrupt. Uh, you know, he, he just takes a little off the top when he steals things. It's okay. We understand. That's just Xandu. That's what he does. You guys are not automated anymore, right? No, I told you. I told you. Fully automate. Why don't you listen? They really want to go here. Fine. Fine. If you want to go kill something, fine. The fleet is actually getting... Pretty good size. What was your job? You're the defense fleet? Fourth, fourth fleet's the invasion fleet. Which we'll get as soon as we get those... Uh, those... Uh, um, transports. What's over here? What do you see? Is it two of them? Oh, they're weaker though. No, oh, there's one down. That guy warped in the wrong spot. I don't my big guys here. Woo. He's nearly down. The other one. The other one's down. Got him. Mad dog got some fission. That planet, that star sings. Okay, back to Kerbis. One of these days we'll colonize this place. I don't know why he's not going there to colonize. Where is he? Oh, are you still being built? Oh, yeah. Takes a long time to build these guys. Another one at... Where's this at? 
way out there. Okay, we learned some Ikuru. We know how to talk to the, the Wookiees now. I'm surprised it's so quiet around me with all this extra space, but there's nothing here. There's no. We need. Maybe we need more. Um, yeah, maybe we should get some more exploration. Need five of those. And one more construction ship. Yeah, checks out. Yeah, I agree. A lot of traffic going back and forth between here, but there's not anything here other than just a lot of mining. Are these all a bunch of asteroids? Oh, yeah. Is that what this is, too? No. Nothing here, but we don't, we don't know what... There is things here, but we don't know what it is. Lots of asteroids with things like... Yeah, we just need more... Yeah, we got one miner. We need just a lot more exploration and uh, construction stuff going on. That'll probably help out a lot. There may be some good plants out there. We just don't know about them. There's that guy. That exploration guy. Mad Dog got me some railgun weaponry. Excellent. Mad Dog. You are a hero. How do I get to where I can get more than one? Build more research stations to increase the maximum number of concurrent research projects. Set the upper limit on research projects in the Empire Policy screen. Policy screen. Ah, look at that. Ah, okay. Yeah, Mad Dog is the national hero. You're right. So now we can do the layer armor and the ionization at the same time. It'll slow them down, but... I'm not sure if it's better. It probably probably evens out, I guess. See now that that now that's a now that's a planet. Where's this at? Way over there. It's not actually not too far. What else is over here? Sandy Desert Planet. That's one. We're, is that how Matt is what we're looking at? Rocky Desert Moon. There's all these all kinds of them. Suitable places, I think. Fuel tanker, sure. Um, I don't want your maps. Dust rings, scenery. That's what we're seeing over here. Xandu got some... Um, we stole some kinetic weapons from the Wookiees. Excellent job. Um, you know, if the, if the Wookiees had a planet that I would like to take, I, I would take it. I might try to anyway. Wookies are over here, aren't they? Um, where where are you at? I forget. Uh, you're way out this way. Do I even know anything about your system? There's a forest planet over. Oh yeah, you like the forests. Yeah, of course. We can go take a look at them and see what they've got. I'm not sure that we can actually fly that far. Yeah, that's too far for our cross. This might be a little more doable, though. I'm sure this is doable. Or some grand underwater caverns. That's certainly doable. When we get where are we getting the transports at? Our transports are just down at the bottom. Uh, we gotta get this one first. Let's do that. Um, inspired conniving. Our successful espionage efforts have inspired our people to embrace our Dayut values. Next year, we expect our efforts in espionage, sabotage, and scan evasion to be more successful. I love it. We have found the Actarians. You want to give me some maps? I would like you to not give me maps. You know what, buddy? You've inspired a nation, mad dog.
we can probably we can probably reach over there and get them. And as soon as we get those transports, I think we I think we went over there and take a look at that place. Okay, construction ship, good. I'm surprised there's nothing in Beta Cupola. Well, we got the one. Is that where that one's at? Yeah. Which will be made eventually. This guy's still being built. Yeah, 80% complete. I suppose it makes sense because this thing is packed full. It will be packed full with like like a billion people or something on, on board that ship. So we got basic diplomacy because uh, uh, Zandu stole that. We'll have ionization in 56 days. Transport systems in 116. Um, I'm going to buy... I have the ship boarding. We need troop transports. Um, transport systems. It's cheap. We'll buy it. When that's done, we'll get the other one. Now we get some deflectors. Maybe we can be a little tougher. This is the one that we're trying to colonize. I think this is the one. It is completely completely explored. Got some plague curing here at this planet. What a place. Ionization is done. So now we're going to get transport systems and troop transports. Troop transports I want to buy. If I click on it. If I click on it over here, will it, will it fast forward or will it kick it out? Oh, there's a movie to it. Okay. Buy that one, and then maybe we probably should get some ground combat. Should probably learn how to fight. I think we are we are good at ground combat anyway, but it'd be nice to have a little more. You know, nothing wrong with an extra pair of boots or something. Whatever ground combat is, I forget. Tech tree's too big, too disorganized. I guess I'm sure you can learn it. But I don't know it. I just saw it. I just saw it. There it is. Ground combat. Um, let's get some zero G, I guess. Well, we've got... Yeah, we'll get the zero G. And then the fission. Okay. Troop transports will be done in less than a year. I'm going to whip up some of those things. And then, when those are done, we're going we're to go... Uh, Go go a raiding. Contact with an unknown empire for, for a lot of money. I gotta tell these guys to stop talking to me. And we're still just, we're still exploring our main home system here. I know it gets expensive, um, but how's our cash flow looking? So our base maintenance is 11,000, troop maintenance is two. 11,000 is up there, so we're losing 4,000 a year. The private economy is doing pretty good, though. They got a lot of money. So as long as they're doing all right, I think we're, I think we're fine. Colony ship is finally done. Take a look at that guy. Is he warping out already? He might warp out already. Yeah, there he goes. How many people are on there? So there's a bunch of that's a trade. That's a trade ship. That's not a not a colony ship. It's going to. It should be going this way. We'll pick him up in a second. Uh, what do you want? Ancient ruins for. Um, you know what? Maybe I that actually might be worth it. I'll take that. Kind of new empire in the Kaidunia system. These are the uh, angry folks, the more talents we played them before. Okay. Try to deal with the menacing marauders. Is it menacing marauders who we just who we just killed? Gave to us Nexus of Kaidunia. We give them money, okay? Isn't the menacing marauders who we killed? 
Isn't that the... the... Right? Oh, these guys. These guys. Okay. Oh, they like us. Um... Hey. What do we need to be... What do we need to get, like, a better treaty? I'm align with your goals. How about, um... I can get tech from you, can't I? You want some colonization worth a lot. I can get transports from you right there. Find a bunch of ruins from you. I'll give you some diplomacy. I remember this being a thing. We can give you diplomacy things with other folks. And that's going to give us a lot of money that we can spend on whatever else. Um, probably not enough to get this stuff, though. If I give you contact with some people, it's still not going to be enough. No, never mind. Give me them. Give me them ruins that are free. I'm just giving you customs and diplomacy things. Yeah. Can I get more? No. I think kind of expensive. Unknown system map. No. All right. Um, I could give them basic colonization. They'll give them colonization modules. I don't think pirates will colonize. But I'll give you that. Uh, in exchange, though, I'm going to want something nice. Like, you don't have anything nice, but I'll take your system map. And I'll take um, some ruins. Why are those red? Okay. So everything but that one. What do you think of that? What? Okay, they accept that one. Okay, so we know they we gave them all kinds of stuff. They gave us some maps and other things. And some ruins. Which they gave us things that are way out here. Yeah. Okay. It makes them happy though, right? They're pleased with us. We're at plus 20. We were at 12 before. So it's going up. <laughs> Yeah, the menacing marauders, they seem trustworthy, you know, with a name like that. You know they have to be good. It's the ones that call themselves like the 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 peace like the peace brothers. Those are the ones you gotta watch out for. They want a non-aggression pact? I accept. Hey, foaming Jay, how's it going? Thanks for the raid. Yeah, it's those uh those uh the honest company, those are the ones you gotta watch out for. All right, um, let's see. You're going to go explore that stuff. And we found an Akruo science ship. Discovered it. Let's go investigate that thing. We've got some scenery bonuses. Where's this at? Ooh, that's a nice planet. That's a real nice planet. Where's this at? Oh, well, we're going there. Colonize that. It's another, another Empire's territory. How do we, how do we, um... How do I make that my territory? I got a mining station over here. How do we expand that? I forget how that works. I think just by just by getting like stations and things out here should do it. Um That's just a little joke. I don't, I don't know if the like the Honest Company was they were like a diaper company. I don't know anything about them, but I remember uh, when my kids were little, my wife was talking about this these diapers from the Honest Company. I was like, Honest Company, like who names their company the Honest Company? There's got to be something shady going on. <laughs> I don't I don't know. Okay, we got a we got a colony over here in Beta Capilla. Uh, the mission succeeded. The agent's exposure will have diplomatic consequences against the uh, the Wookies. That's fine. I don't like them anyway. <clears throat> it was made, uh, what's, like, an actress, I think it was, like, spokesman or something with that, with them. I don't remember what it was. So we gotta figure out how to get, oh, there's a fleet there. Let's send our fleet over there. They're going, they're getting retrofitted right now. Which they probably shouldn't do just yet. We'll get those deflectors and then they can retrofit themselves. In just a second. 
Um, my invasion fleet, however, can top up with, with ships with some troop transports. The Pekian have declared war on the Wookiees. That's a bummer. We'll pick up the scraps. We may need to send a fleet over there. Who is who's the green people? These guys. They're displeased with us. I'll show you dis displeasure. Got a fleet ref retrofitted, so we'll get that stuff in there. Target tracking is going to be coming in here as well. <laughs> yeah, the Democrat. Yeah, the People's Democratic Republic of North Korea. <laughs> <laughs> Holy Roman. <clears throat> All right, we've found a new empire, the Psy Mirth Empire. All right. So these guys are fighting. Oh, they took one already. All right, hang in, hang in there, Wookiees. Railguns are done. Nice. Zandu is uh, stealing. I don't want. I don't want the Wookies to die because I keep taking. All, I I'm taking so much of their stuff. I like having them around. I don't know that I even need any tech. Like we don't need to research anything. We just steal stuff. I need more spies. Is there a way if I can encourage more spies to come in here? I could really use some more. I don't want that. Yeah, I know that was like that was like a thing in history classes the holy roman empire was was neither holy roman or an empire <laughs> okay this was that one the grand shrine of beta beta capilla it's governed of grand shrine ancient ruins of a lost civilization at the volcanic planet we just have to ruins sit on a stone ledge overlooking a fiery lake of lava well get in there and look at it Prepare to repel enemy fire. These ruins provide the following colony bonuses. A ton of good stuff. We get, we get it by building a research station there. We acquire scenery bonuses by building a resort base there. Take me there. Get to work on that station. What a place. Too bad I can't live here. But we can get a tourism place. And we probably should get... Um, I don't remember where those are. The, the tourism one. That one? Resort. Yeah. Get that one in there next. Construction yards would be nice to have. Advanced, um, enhanced civilian ships might be nice to have. Yeah. The Crooked Queen. Oh, that's my ship. Okay, fission. Tracking research done. Good stuff. The, uh, the mining station is under attack by insidious anarchy of the clan of superiority. Who? Who are you? You're attacking me? Wait a minute. I thought we were friends. It's okay, I was itching to fight someone anyway. Okay, they're already they're already on their way, it looks like. Yeah, they're already on their way. Hang in their station. Ooh, they're going down. It's going down quick. They blew it up. Transports. They blew up my station. Was very nice. And this is this is my this is my new planet. Um, yeah, we need you guys over here. Four fleet, won't you get over here as well? Yep. Zero G's done. What was the flag for? I missed it. Colony's been being raided. Uh, raided our colony and took all kinds of stuff. Where are these guys? Do we know where these guys are? 
I bet you they're one of these. I don't think we actually do know where their their home base is. We will find it. And we're gonna kill them. Okay, we're gonna fly over there real quick. Yeah, I saw that. They're not attacking me here, are they? Okay. Okay, they're arriving there now. Probably have to get a fleet that's going to have to sort of hang out here. And defend this place. Ooh, some wars going on. We gotta find these guys. Um, you're gonna go back to defend. Right? I forget which fleet's which. Transport. No, you you you, you invade. And you guys I want you to go and I'm giving a feel for this. Not really. I put you, I'm going to put you on attack. Hopefully our exploration ships can figure out where these guys are at. What's over here? Just a monster, probably. Neutral with us. Our strategy is to conquer them. Ally with those guys. Better attack there. He's gonna attack by those guys. I wonder where they are. They're like somewhere around this way. Okay, the um, the great Xenox have been encountered. Ooh, are they way over here. Oh, that's the, that's the other folks. In Kerbis, we're getting attacked. Where are you at? In Kerbis. We'll go deal with this. You don't think explorers are the quickest way to find a pirate home port? What is the quickest way, then? I don't know. Threat at Kerbis 7. And threat at Kerbis... Yeah, sure. Go. Go over there. Where is 7? Right here. That's me. Oh, they're at my home world. The Ubridon domination. That's my people. As a result, they have initiated a restricted trade agreement with us. They would like to be our favorable towards a treaty with us at some time in the future. Offers a galaxy map and a research from a galaxy map. Yeah, you know what? Sure, sure. And that's that. Next, new tech is done. Where are you guys at? Oh, wow. They're right here. They've explored all kinds of stuff. Okay. Where's this one at? It's got us on it. It is... A little ways out there. Wait, so that's Uberdon and that's Uberdon? Same name? Well, that's not confusing. 
My station here is getting hit by this, this terror. He seems to be uh, succeeding, and they are raiding my base. You guys are refilling, retrofitting. Uh, do we have any ships that we can make? Not you. Not a fuel tanker. I wonder if we should make another, like another, just like a defense fleet and stick them at beta, whatever. Attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let's make. Let's make me a frigate. We'll get another fleet, and we'll make another uh, like a defense fleet. Doesn't need to be a lot of ships, just a few ships, and we'll throw them. We'll throw them into defend there. There's a lot here. 500? Where are they? There's a lot over here. Um, what are you guys doing? Retrofitting. I need you. Come over here. More, more of them? Offers map sharing, sure, sure. Xandu evaded some detection. I mean, we're like best friends with with our uh, with our other uh, spider people. Oh wait, wait, we have wait us wait what? We have mining. These are our mining stations way out, way out here. Uh oh, where's this at? In uh, what system? This slippery interlude needs to get out of there. What is that? That looks just a colony over there. Okay, where did I send this fleet off to? That's not a good plan. That's not a good idea. Uh, can't cancel those orders. I want you guys. Just just go here for now, and then, and then just cancel those orders. Threats in the Naharka system, which is way out there. I don't want to do that. Is that... So I... Oh, you know what? I bet you that was one we... F did we find one, and then they, like, gave us some, some spots? I don't think we colonized that. Offers a galaxy map and research, and I'm gonna get, he wants sensors, research, sure. Sure, friend. That is my stuff out that's getting attacked. If I had a smaller fleet, that'd work out alright. This guy's going to guard Capital 2, which maybe it might be a good idea. Maybe we just make a bunch of ships, and they'll just, like, not being in fleets, and they'll defend just the little things that come in. That would be a bad idea. Something like that. Just whip up a few ships and get them. They'll go and defend. And they'll uh, hopefully keep some stuff a little bit safer. I don't have any other tech going on. I am um, debating on if we want to. What if we? Let's see what we can do with the tech. Like, if we want to go to research and, and automate it. Can I tell you what? I can tell you where to put, where to focus, I think. Maybe putting it in the missile weapons. That's probably good. We'll let, him, we'll let him handle that. We found the new uh, rat folk empire. This weapon's done already. We've got there's a war with uh, Xenox and, and, the, and the humans. Humans. 
The base is getting raided again. Way out there. It's way out there. It's too big of a fleet, though, for really me to send, like, one ship. But they're going to destroy everything. Wherever that is. You know why Europe's like a frying pan? Like you know why Europe is like a frying pan? Because they both have grease at the bottom. Got my Europe jokes today. Um, got the uh, the Nero surgeon grease at the bottom. I'll see if I can find some more. Uh, more more uh, 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 spider people. Excellent, excellent. Hello, friend. I think that when I when two spiders see each other, they typically don't get along very well. So I'm not sure why we like these guys so much. Where's that one at? Over there. What if we can like there's a chance of success here. Venerable quest to colonize colony. Maybe. Do I have a colony ship? I do. I'm gonna try there's a there's a low chance, but there is a chance. Like Italy, you should give it I should give you the boot. It's not the, not the best chance, but it's a chance. Let's go for it. Go say hello to those guys. And then I do have a, a job for my fleet. Second fleet. You're going to go and you're just going to camp out over here. There's a, there's a planet here that I really want. I don't remember where it is. I think it's this one. Come over here. If let's say you uh, you come in here and you destroy some things, then I won't be opposed to that, you know? I won't be mad. They do have three systems now, though. Non-aggression? Sure. My best friend, Spider Buds. Clan of Superior. Can, look, can, you, can you just stop that? You're the one doing this? Look. I don't like you. You don't like me. Have some money. This doesn't, this obviously, it doesn't, mean, doesn't necessarily mean they won't attack us, but... There's a chance, I guess. Got some research labs. Maybe they'll leave me alone over here now. And we'll go see if we can colonize that one, which that might be him. That, there he is over there. We got my fleet heading over this way to this place. We're going to go bomb some things. Uh, we do have an invasion fleet. Discover the ancient Ikuro building, ancient lost civilization, again in a mangrove forest. Uh, the damaged world is so sign of having once been inhabited. Inhabitants were Akuro. Let's investigate. We found all kinds of cool stuff. It's at this place, the mangrove planet. Uh, that's not too far away. Is that colonizable? Not in my, my list of colonizable things. We're having some talks with these fellas. Um, we built. Oh, there's already bases there. That's why. That's why it's not letting me. Okay. Well, we're gonna uh, have a chat. Fleet, second fleet. I believe this planet belongs to me now. You're taking my valuable resources. Not allowed to happen anymore. Uh, can I can I get a colony ship? Um, well, well, I guess we'll do it whenever we... Um, we'll give it a second. Make sure we don't die here. Nice. Okay, second fleet. Um, get that guy out of here. We're gonna take this planet. 
we're just gonna destroy them, kick them out of here, so I can so I can take it. Um, and now we're, now we're the pirates. Second fleet, your job is just to attack. And my mission I have for you though is to take this system. Swampy caverns. I do have some things around. Invasion's going on. Okay. Um. Wait, don't go to the spaceport. No, 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 no. Uh, independent colony of these guys. Uh, I want you to go and how do I tell them? I, th I know I can give them orders. I forget how to how to command like their thing. Mantaran dis uh, discovered. I know. Okay, so I so I come in here and I can go into military, and I've got it set at use for ships for bases. When stronger than the target, you go take those bases. Um, enlist base upgrade, enlisted military ships. Sure. Characters, characters at conquered colonies or bases capture if enemy. I'm gonna refuel manual ships. You can go ahead and do all the this stuff. I'm going to try putting this back on automated and see what happens. Let's see what it does for it. What it does to us. Um, how do we do it? I have to open the context menu of that. Oh, we got them on attack. Can I tell them to attack like a, like a specific attack? Oh, I have to go here to get that one. I click to send the second fleet to prepare to attack. Okay, assign fourth fleet to prepare to attack. Where? Way out there? Sure, go for it. Uberdon. Galaxy map? Sure. Okay, they've been invaded. Let me get the beginnings of it. Let's get another fleet. Oh, yeah, we're not at war, are we? This is the Nami. Okay, let me talk to these guys. Hey, you. I hate your face. And your 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 bubbly face, it's the worst. We declare war on you. Okay. Trade? Sure. Tend to colonize uh that place. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Okay. Map for a whole lot of money, I don't want that. Defense missiles for some money. I'll take some defense missiles. I'm not opposed to that. Under attack over there. They're gonna fly in here. Where are you? Oh, you're going. Where are you going? Oh, you're going up. Yeah, yeah. You're going up to Ubradon. I'm not sure why you're going there, but you know you want to go. I'm not gonna stop you. Offers this military refueling. Good idea. Okay. Missiles done. Um, merchant getting attacked. So there is the second fleet on their way to take out this one, and the fourth fleet is heading up there. Let me get... I mean, you're actually in that... Oh, you're in fourth fleet. Cutting Revenge is, is over here defending things. I'm going to send Cutting Defense to a fifth fleet. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, fifth fleet. There you go. So fifth fleet... 
There's nobody in it. We're going to go ahead and top it up. Uh, sorry, I made the wrong thing. Uh, you will be a... I think attack fleet is fine. Top you up. And you're going to do your killing. Okay, so they're going to go do their thing over there. Hey, Stavros, how's it going? And they're heading over here into Uberdon, which I don't know why they're itching for Uberdon. I guess it's because it's a nice place to take. And this is my fourth fleet, which is my invasion fleet. And there is eight troop trans transports here. So what are you guys doing here? There's a nice resort planet here. You gonna go invade them? Yeah, don't let me stop you. So there's gonna be a ground invasion going on here as soon as we can, if we can get in there. Which is what they're doing. They'll start sending out the the shuttle pods, I guess. Here in a second. And we should get some combat action going on here. Here we go. There's a thousand of us. A thousand of us. Excellent. Okay. Overwhelming awe. That's right. Okay. I believe this planet belongs to me. Look at them rings. I like it. Okay, tech acquired. We got ourselves some research. Cool. Uh, continental colonization research complete. That's cool. We got continental colonization from that that takeover. Scientists been pursuing the wrong path of research for destroyers. You dang scientists. Our war readiness is, is actually not looking so good. Um... I'm not sure how to read this. You guys destroying things over here still? Second fleet. Um, like, destroy everything. Frigate's getting made. We got a colony founded. Uh, where's this at? And, oh, over there. Oh, okay. That one. Yeah, that's where I wanted you to go anyway. Excellent. Okay. Good. I mean, we got that one up there now. We found a new uh, freighter. We'll go and investigate the hardy dream. Okay. Smashing firestorms attacking us over here. But that's over here. We've got our second fleet hanging out. And their job is to keep this place... Um, free of anything green. Who's actually here? Is that our people? That's, this is where we just conquered. We just we just built. We got a um, an ancient vault. We'll go investigate that. What a lovely place. Uh, Marauders eliminated by the uh, the hive. Wait, that's my friend. Wasn't that my wait? Is that, I don't remember who's who. Those are my friends. What'd you kill my? F Those are my best friends. <laughs> um, these guys are friendly. What's what's these guys? We already have non-aggression pact with them. I'm not sure what we need to get like an alliance. Maybe plus forty. Let's see what we can get with them. Limited trade. Oh, I can offer limited trade. We already have free trade. Doesn't align with our goals. Okay. Yeah, I don't care about that. What's wrong with green? We hate them. They only have two legs, and we feel that that is outrageous. Okay, you go get them. Okay, we got some uh, splinters or whatever. And uh, Zandu's doing a good job. The Wookiees are still alive, and we're still able to steal from them, so that's great. Is that my, my fleet over there? What are they doing over there? I'm not sure what they were doing over there. I 
on ve attack vector towards Bree by my home world. Where? Oh, they're actually there. Okay. Well, we, my, um, the Great Emperor fleet is here. How tough are they? Not too bad. Now we get some fighting. Oh, look, they're, look at them. They look cool. Kind of like a little bit of a Romulan thing going on with them. I just took off. I haven't seen the new ships yet. The, the, the Wookiee ships. Belligerent Tyrant. What a name for a ship. Look, we've destroyed three bases, right? It seems like it should be like... It's plus 11,000 them. Does that mean they are winning? Surely not. I'm to go hit them like at one of their places here. New Empire in the Kalen system, the Web of Destiny. And then my buddies also. Trade deal, I'll take it. And, okay, that's done. What else we got here? Uh, immediate end of the war, they will also give me a mining station. Sure. Okay, Web of Destiny declared war on the Hive. Um, if you want me to go help you out, I'll, I'll go kill someone. It means we're winning, yeah. It seems it seems like it's, it's just just at glance. It seems the wrong way. It seems like it should be eleven thousand yellow, because I'm the one doing the killing. Liberated of stars. I like. They're very AI-generated names, it seems like, <laughs> for the names of the places. Oh, they're pirates. They want us to pay them money. I'm not paying you money. Look how broke I am. I can't give you any money. So can't be invaded. Being invaded by... Is this, is this who's invading you? The green fellas? The I'm not sure who it is. It's like Darian, right? That's that's who's who's here. There's the Wookiees over there. Oh, these are the hive. So the um okay, so that's the hive. These three spots. Um We'll go take a hive. Following off. A research agreement. Exploration and territory fueling. Yeah. Um, we want to conquer them. A lot of trade with these guys, but we don't care. Let's go talk with them. I'm going to declare war on you. Okay. Where's that? It's way out there. Wookiees have declared war on the on the uh, the Pykean as well. Fifth Fleet, go uh, deal with threats out that way. That's too far. No, please don't do that. The Fierce Sun Warriors. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, fifth Fleet to Thanazelbra. Yes. Second Fleet there as well. Okay. So we'll move our fleets over to the space left here. We'll deal with this, and then we'll move our way, and we'll take out these fellows. The third fleet has no mission at the moment. Uh, do you need a, an upgrade? No, you're good. Everyone's been up, been uh, retrofitted. You're loading troops up. And you're going to Uberdan getting the troops. Okay. 
Ion Weapon Tech is done. So to Thanta Zelbra here. We're just going to hit that that mining station there. Yeah. Look at those ships. Okay. Good job. We should take that and then move probably into there. Grab that one. Isn't Kaylin? Kaylin has my people on it. Kaylin has Dayat people on it, but it's controlled by these guys. This is where I want to go. So I want second fleet. I don't know where you guys are at. Where are you? Over there. Okay, yeah. I want you to go straight to Kalen and take that. Uh, bring, bring these guys as well. They're bringing, they're grabbing troops right now. There is a bunch. There's fifteen thousand, but they can hold a bunch more. We got a foreign agent. What? A Spider-Man? They've been imprisoned. So they're over here now. We got a bunch of them. So what do we do with our, what do we do with our prisoners? So we got this guy. We can try to recruit him. This guy's a spider. I wanna, I wanna recruit this guy. How much? Thirty thousand. Yeah. Recruited. Excellent. Excellent. I don't want anyone else. If they're not a spider, I don't think I want them. I think we just chop some heads off. How? Um. I guess I should have looked at how good they were. This guy's actually pretty good. So I will recruit him as well. Okay. It did not work. And we're gonna we're not gonna return him, we'll just hang on to these guys. Okay, we are definitely winning this fight. So they're on the way there, and then we're gonna get we're gonna go take Kaylin here in a second. Once that fleet you're moving to spaceport. I want you, not you. Yeah, you. Come over here to Kaylin. They're gonna show up here in a second, and when they do, you're gonna come whoop, take that, that one. Okay. So there goes Fleet Two, Fleet. Um, Invasion fleet. The Actarian declared war on us. Where are they even at? I'm not sure who you are. I don't see the flags. You're not Actarian. Okay, it's conquered. Yeah, I got some fleets. Fifth fleet to there, yes. Let's destroy these guys. Actarian, I don't know where these guys are. These guys, how do we know where they are? Is it like... Is there you jump in to see where they are? We had this problem when I played this game when it first came out. A lot of crashes. Don't tell me you broke. Okay, thank you. Okay, so you guys are... A Daring Coalition, you are way up there. Okay, you're nowhere near me. Uh, you... Yeah, you're not really anywhere. Well, you're kind of close to my, my place there. Did you take it? No, I still have this one, but yeah, you're kind of... Close to me there. Okay, so this should be going on now. Second fleet, maybe. Okay. Trade, you were. Sure. So, 
Looks like they got a fleet here as well. Build a colony ship, sure. The wolf was taken over. Where? My fleet. Here it comes. Okay, that fleet's over there fighting. They took one of my ships and they destroyed one. Well, they destroyed one of my ships. Okay, so we're just now showing up. We're just now arriving. Got a lot of things going around here. A lot of base defenses on this this side. Ooh. But nobody stops fearsome aggressor. Uh, we should get some things landing here pretty soon. They don't have much of a much of a defense. So if we can get our invasion fleet in, we should be able to get them. Troop transports are under a ship, under an attack here. They have quite a fleet here. 2,000. It's quite a fleet. Hardy Dream? I remember seeing you before. Fleet did very good there. Yeah, we could kind of beat down there. Oh, we're just those are just not moving in. And then over here in Pike Pikeian. Choppy choppy. That guy's disabled. Uh the Agdarians wanna wanna end the war? Sure. Pay money or, or attack us. Get out of here. Uh, giant scoundrels in our attack. Hey, GMT, how's it going? So we've got both those attacks going on. And uh, maybe just splitting our fleet isn't the best idea. According to this, we're winning the war by a lot. I think. Oh yeah, I think we got him. So I don't see as much. Oh yeah, here we go. So my fleet has just now arrived. This is the third fleet and fourth fleeter here. There's a lot of them. Oh, that didn't that changed things. Well, we lost. We lost. You took up. You blew up 14 of my ships. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can we get something better than... Can we get some destroyers? It's been a lot of money here. It's going the wrong way now. That's cool looking. Looks like ours. But this was a spider planet, and then they got conquered by these. Uh, apparently, these guys are a lot tougher than the uh, the other folks we attacked. Okay, so you're on on manual. I'm gonna switch you over to you are the invasion, right? Fourth fleet invasion, and you are the attack fleet. I'd like you to take that, but I understand if you can't quite just yet. I was hoping that together, me and the other the other uh, folks could, you know, do something here. Uh, war? No, we don't decline that war. New attack. Oh, whoops. What do you got? A tsunami in Villosea. Don't care. Get him, scoundrel. You lost. You failed. Well, that didn't end 
Well, we got all we went over there and got beat down. We had such a good war score, and then everybody failed. Uh, well, I I did I did commission some fleets, but I just did those because I wanted um, a big group of cruisers. Hey, Drax, how's it going? Under attack in the Kalen system. Uh, colony ship is done. Do we have a, a place for it? I guess we failed at one of it. We have a 60% chance of a success over here in Trayton. There's already some of our spider people there. We should go to that one. I can't really go to Pike and we're at war with those guys. Let's go. They want a free trade agreement. Let's go. Um, I'll accept that. 100% success. Let's go there. Let's just go colonize it. We'll just basically just join up with these guys. And that'll be my colony over there. Perfect. They have offered to end the war. Um, I guess I'm going to have to. I don't want to, but I guess I'm going to have to. Because that didn't go well. It didn't go well as in we didn't uh, completely destroy them. We, we, well, I guess we broke a couple things. and But then we went maybe a little too far. Maybe I should have like uh, been a little more conservative and not just charged in there like that um let's go see if we can colonize this place and that might be a good 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 high note to end this this stream on we gotta go out on a high notes i think this might this might qualify black moon authority is attacking me but now that everyone's automated and we got defense plenty of defense ships and if i build the ships and i don't put them in a fleet then they'll they'll be a defense ship as well uh what's that one Patriot Wave has occurred in Spigum. I don't know where that is. Oh, way over here. Wave of intense patriotic spirit sweeps through the colony. I'll stay away from that place. Free trade with them. You mean give them 17,000 credits and a, and a map? I don't want to do that. Ramazine Dom... Dom isn't that my spider folk? it is. We got five billion, oh, four billion, five colonies and four billion spiders now, though. I take that as a success. We're about to get some more, though, once my colony ship makes his way up there, and there he is, I believe. That's curious. Mm, he's heading that way somewhere. Not sure where he is, but somewhere there's a colony ship heading that way. I forget where to, I forget where to see that guy. Mm, not you. I don't know where I, I don't forget where I see my where I see my colony ships. Probably in the is it in the colony um map. There he is. There he is. So we'll get a planet over there. That'll work out all right. Uh, yeah, I haven't had a crash yet. Sorry, I missed I missed the second part of that question. Um, more stable. Um, yeah, it seems to be, I've I haven't had a couple points where I think it's an autosave going on and it'll lag for a minute, but everything's been fine so far. It's starting to get a little a little chunky here as, as time goes on, but we've, we've discovered almost half the galaxy so far. I'm not sure how, how well it would, how well it would do, um, you know, with the full galaxy, but right now it's all right. Seems like a lot of folks flying down here for some reason. Not quite sure why. So, you, you defend, you are my... Can I top you guys off? Uh, top up with ships. And you're also attack fleet. You should top up. And... Well, we gotta get more ships, I guess. Mad Dog got evaded again. Mad Dog, still a hero. Is that him? There he is. It'll take him a little while to get there and, and colonize, but... Let's see what we got over here. 
This is this one. There's 300 million. Ooh, another ring planet. Apparently it's a little stormy right now. Oh, it's in a nebula, isn't it? Oh, uh, yeah. Um, there's a nebula. There's the nebulas. I think we can get in there, okay. I guess we'll find out. Tourism flow of of all races. Tourism flow. Look at Kerbis we got going. Yeah, these people. Apparently went some tourism. How about the migration flow? How are we looking? It's like a lot of these folks are moving in to me. We're moving up to the two Uber Dans we're moving to. Okay. And then we got resource resource flows of whatever there is. And you can see them bouncing around wherever they're going. And then exploration. Green, all explored. Yellow, some. And I guess not yellow is everything else. Diplomatic relations. That's a little easier to see some things, actually. With, it, with that on. Green's us. And they, not, they don't like us very much over here. Uh, these guys actually... Oh, well, yeah, they don't like us either. No one really likes us. Except for our spider friends. Where are they at? I don't... Oh, here they are. Yeah, these are our best buds. That's why there's a lot of trade and stuff going on from these guys. Okay, the colony has... Colony ship, I believe, has arrived. Assuming he survived the trip over here. Where is he? There he is. Okay, so he's now... He just arrived. Oh, I'm broke all of a sudden. I'm real broke all of a sudden. All that money going. So we're spending 14000 for our a lot of maintenance. And private ship maintenance is a lot. Free trade sounds like a good deal. And we got some tech in here. They may have just spent a lot. I bet you the I turned it on where they can they can spend money on um speeding along tech. Maybe what they're doing. Oh, they're putting tech into like language. Outrageous. Hey we got a we got a destroyer now. Let's go look at that destroyer. Okay. I wanna see him. You. I wanna see you. There he is. Oh yeah, look at that guy. I don't know why he's sitting like that. Can't you, can't you sit on the right plane in space? <laughs> Another independent colony of these folks? You are colonizing, right? Where he stopped. I must have, I must have clicked. It's weird. Kasim is still a, uh, a chance, but there is bad guys there around. So we have 100% chance of, of this working. Is, it, is there something happening here? Critical failure. Colonize that. Is he, why is he stopping? Thirty. There's thirty million. Not as much as I thought there was. Okay, there he goes. I'm not sure why he was stopping. Maybe my money. Oh, yeah, maybe money. Okay, we got it. They happily join your empire. Yeah, they do. Are uh, you making me any money? Oh, you're losing money. Of course you are. Build some passengers and some mining ships. 
And we got a new sh a new planet way out here. Mad Dog is evading detection and grabbing some beam weapons because he's a hero. And we're starting to see the other side of the, of the galaxy over here. Diplomacy is actually not bad because then we can kind of see the pictures of the people and figure that out as well. If these guys like me, this is this is the one I was trying to colonize also. Uh, Kasim, which I, mean, I might be able to do it now. They like me a lot more. 85% chance. I can try it. Head over there and get that. Map sharing, sure. Oh, yeah, look at that. Dagaba. Non aggression from the, the pirates. Oh, I didn't mean to do protection. Oops. Anyway, that is a. Um, that's a high note, if I ever saw one. And I think that means it's a good place to call it a day. There's the distant worlds. Distant Worlds too. Um, quite pleased with uh, with the changes uh, from the last time I played. Stable. Um, I remember last time. I remember there was a, a lot of little issues just with my fleet trying to control my fleets and them not like they wouldn't conquer planets or they just they would like all arrive like one at a time whenever they'd fly in. There's a lot of little changes I noticed with that that has changed. Warfare was always kind of a, just just annoying before and it's, that seems to have been taken care of from what I've seen here so I'm pleased but anyway let's call it a day these guys like me a lot you won't do any sort of like I can't do like is there anything better than what we've got it's not like a, like a there's not just like a like an alliance or anything Someone's getting, de they're getting declared war on. But, um, anyway. Kazim wants to join us. Sure. We're already doing that. So they're going to come join us over here also. All the spiders will join together and, and we will rise up. And crawl through the, uh, the bathtub drains of space. And web our opponents. Uh... <laughs> And something else. Anyway, let's call it a day. I'm gonna go ahead and save it. Uh, I'm not sure I'll come back to this, but if if there's enough of it, an itching to do so, I may come back and play a little more. Um, but let's uh, wrap it up here. There's Distant Worlds two with the Aurora update. I don't, there was a bunch of other stuff that came out, and then the the new Ikuro and Diut uh, factions, which we saw those, of course. Um, what else? We need? There's a lot of cross crashes that got fixed, and a bunch of little tip uh, fixes in here. We didn't do any 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 of that, which I didn't try doing any of that. Which that's what we that's kind of what we do. But oh well. All right. Thanks for hanging out tonight.